All right, good morning. Today's the day. Everybody asking how, how much time do we have? No one knows. My guess, my guess is anywhere between uh, 15 minutes and an hour. I think I think it will be about 10, 11 my time, which is about 8, 9 his time. Because he's said on Twitter multiple times as soon as he wakes up and gets caffeinated. And I don't think he has a abhorrent sleep schedule like I do. So he's probably up at a normal time. Which is... Yeah, eight nine. I think he'll have it live, unless if something goes wrong, which I think he said he would send. By dancing? No, I'm Gina McCarding, actually. Um, I think. I would like to, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it the way that I want to do it. I never turn on the camera. That scam. No, you'll get it eventually. I just. I wasn't really motivated to stream the past few days, so I just chose to not to save my energy for today. I'll eventually get it. Yeah, uh, hopefully, I'm, uh, I mean, yeah, I'm hoping it goes out during, like, an hour mark. I was kind of, I thought, like, I've been awake longer than I normally should have been. But, uh, you know, I thought he would release it earlier, and then as, like, the day went on, I'm just like, oh, he's probably just gonna release it around now like i thought I, I thought about starting stream like almost an hour ago and then i'm like okay if he doesn't release it during if he doesn't release it in like 15 minutes from now i'm gonna be streaming for so long and i'm just gonna hate the stream so it's like i waited <laughs> i waited a little bit longer than i should have um uh, i not really should have but Uh, uh, we're basically waiting for this thing to go, uh, update is ready. I know I'm gonna be getting a lot of subs right now because I haven't streamed in four days. I do appreciate it all, and I'm, like, semi-ignoring it while setting up the stream. It, do it does mean a lot, guys. And I'll probably get to it at some point, but I'm, like, half, like, just setting up stream still as we patiently wait. <sighs> but, yeah, it's been... Four years since the release. Uh, I'm sorry. Three years. Just over three years since the release of 1.5. Thirty years. Apparently Lee has been... Lee was doing a perfection run the other day. Well, the issue is, is I want to play Junimo Kart as we wait, but I don't know if the update queue will show up if I'm playing the game. I will be using the new farm layout. I say I'm doing a perfection speedrun, but it's more going to be a speedy casual playthrough where I kind of just run through a lot of the random shit and then kind of just like you know just complete it quickly and get to the new stuff or whatever did you know car uh no i mean even my offline things like if i i i this morning i saved all the 1.5 uh files 
I saved a 1.5 version of my desktop, and even if I open it up through that, it's going to open up through Steam. Because that's just how it works. That's just how I have it set up. I didn't even back up my saves. I just backed up the 1.5 files so I can downgrade if needed to. Gotta be. So it's kind of like one of those things. Do I expect CC to be faster or slower? If you asked me a week ago, I would have said slower. But there's a possibility that it's slightly faster and it's not even due to being a new route. Happy 1.6 day. Oh, I would CC be faster. Uh, specific hotkeys were added. Very interesting hotkeys, to say the least. 1.6 is not out. We have to wait for this to say update queued, <laughs> basically. And I'm, I'm waiting until 10 and maybe like a little slightly after 10. And if it doesn't say update queued, I'm launching and playing Junmo Kart. Because I don't think it's not going to launch within like an hour time frame. So it's either going to launch in like 6 minutes, slightly after for like upload time. Or it's going to launch in an hour from now. Has added in the new update. Uh, a lot of things. A lot of things. The update is on par, if not greater than 1.5 in content added. So you don't need to pay me a hundred <laughs> on YouTube. New fish just in time for 1.6. 1 1.6? I don't think that's pretty early. Can you call? No, I'm not gonna annoy this man on update day. And his team already has his work cut out for him. Yes, I'm very well aware that uh, we have to wait for him to wake up and have coffee. And I think for a person of CA's mentality, he, he wakes up probably around like seven eight his time and then it's gonna take him like maybe an hour to wake up and have coffee and shit so right now it's like eight his time so if he wakes up at seven i say we'll have the update in about 10 minutes if he wakes up at eight we'll probably have to wait another hour I thought Dabs CA is a very interesting man and updates shit when he wants to update. Uh, AM or PM? AM. He, like, the update... Uh, my, my best guess based off of how he functions and how other updates have basically functioned, it's either in 10 minutes or an hour.
Yeah, he's also specific time in the U.S., so I'm going off of where C.A. lives, not where anybody else. I don't care where anybody else lives right now. I care where C.A. lives. Am I reading patch notes? Uh, no, because <laughs> I don't need to. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. Everybody's theorizing. No one knows. What's my strategy? Uh, experience. Just get in there and do whatever the hell I want because it's not going to be a true speedrun since it's unrouted. I'm just going to have fun with it. Thing I'm most excited for. Uh... The Iridium Scythe is interesting. Let's just say it changes the start of how Perfection Speedruns will be. Drinking Mayo. Yes, that's what all chat is known about. I think it would be better for Mayo. Uh, I do not know. Uh, I'm going to do all like the new settings piano. So I'm going to do uh, random because I don't care to clay farm in a run like this. I will be on the new farm type as well. That's how I did it for uh, 1.5. The first day 1.5 came out, I did a perfection speed run on the beach farm. So, may as well keep with the tradition. So, we will be doing the new farm type. We will be doing all, or ideally, all the new settings. We'll see if I uh, go back on them. It's not going to be like a normal like speed run at the start. I'm going to be experimenting with some shit or some stuff. Like, it's a speed run where i'm going to be you know hurrying at the start trying to get to the new content but uh it's not going to be the fastest thing in the world there's so much stuff on the new update that i i wouldn't I, it would take too long to get to and i want to get to it no one knows the update time the official update time my my theorized time in my head that I think it will be in is either 10 minutes or an hour and 10 minutes. We shall see, because it is now 10, which is 8 CA's time. We are just here talking while I occasionally leak shit. That I probably shouldn't, but I'm doing anyways. Thank you for the subs, by the way. I probably should just go through those now. Uh... Uh, let's go through them all because I am slow. Elaine, thank you for the 19. Kemi, thank you for the 17. Uh, Mantrix, thank you for the uh, full year. Welcome to the Sturgeon Squad and your emotes and Bunja. Charlotte, thank you for the 13 months. Brake, thank you for the 53. Lexus, thank you for the tier 3 for two full years. Enjoy your new fish. Uh... You never say the start of your name. The word, thank you for the resub for 14. Uh, uh, Wonderland, thank you for the prime. Hum, 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 thank you for the six months of prime. Advanced Cow, thank you for the prime as well. Tangerine, thank you for the 100 bits. Pico Wombat, thank you for the prime for two full years. Enjoy your new fish as well. Uh, we got a level three hype train. That was fun. Thank you, thank you. Tiny Potato, thank you for the resub for 28. Abby, thank you for the five gifted subs. Uh, Siny, we are ready for 1 Sinny, thank you for the full year as well. Welcome to the official Stargan squad. Enjoy your emotes and Abandra. Jens, or yeah, Jen Simon, 
Thank you for the prime. Jay, thank you for the three full years. Enjoy your, I think we have a new badge at three years. I don't know. And Miss Ad, er, Adeline. Thank you for the tier one for 11 months as well. It is today. I'll give it another like five minutes and then I'm going to launch and play. Uh, I'll give it another five minutes and then I'm going to launch and play Junimo Kart. Again, the reason why I'm just sitting here on this uh, screen right here is I'm waiting for this to say update queued. Also, let me fix my... Timer and actually get the right timer. The A said he'll update it when he gets up and gets caffeinated and ready to start his day. And that is... Not yet, obviously. Gotta give this man some time. I have the auto auto splitter. I'm gonna have to disable the load time remover, otherwise uh It's not going to work on the thing. Why I started the only game I have because it's the only game I'm searching for. I didn't want to show my games library. No. Why do you think we're not launched yet? We're waiting for this to say update queued. reading youtube chat only i mean saying that in the last in my entire feed of messages how long until the update how, <laughs> or how long until the update has been asked one two uh three four <laughs> four times in the last like 20 messages kind of entertaining Ellie chat. Uh. I thought he said he was only gonna make a notification when, uh, if things went wrong. Fine, we'll play. I don't think it will say update queued though. I don't think it will say it. That other Asian person, thank you for the 21. Uh, and a blow stuff, thank you for the prime. Bonjour. 
I don't know, and we're gonna find out. And honestly, uh, honestly, even if I uh don't, even if it doesn't, uh, <laughs> chat will be spamming it to me, saying that the update is live. So I don't think I really have to worry about it. It's kind of just uh funny. We're just going to play Genova Carter as we wait. Is Genova Kart different in 1.6? As far as I'm aware, no. There may have been a quality of life change, but I would have to reread. Thank you. Thank you for the uh, Prime. I think it's the same. the most I'm looking forward to uh I will say the iridium scythe since it's public but basically things correlating to that from what I've read yes The new items are very interesting. I will be on the new farm type, yes, Jules. You do start with a new coop on the new farm. Funny enough, if you want if you want that opinion, I don't think it's really that good. <laughs> Starting with a coop. Some people might think it's like the most broken thing, but it's it's pretty mid. The just starting with a coop. It's not nearly as good as you think it would be. Animals outside of literally rabbits and pigs are still kind of just trash. Do I think? No. If you asked me this question a week ago, I would have told you that this patch would be slower for speedrunning, but there was a few changes added towards the end that, uh, I would say it's slightly faster. Um, and it's not even dealing with, uh, making route changes. It's just literally just hotkeys. So it's nice to run on the new patch, but I don't think any major developments will change because of it. One point six is today, yes. And again, I'm looking at it from a very mid maxi speedrunning point uh perspective, but other than that, uh yeah. it's a cool farm. How do I feel about drinking drinkable mayo? Uh uh, polarizing opinion. I don't like mayo. Not really. Some people just don't like mayo. I didn't think I would hit that bubble. Liar. V, literally when you were talking about it in the, in the Discord yesterday, I called you unbased for enjoying mayo. And then when you said your husband disliked Mayo, I said he was based.
Uh, we are killing time, yes. I would change my title saying 1.6 is out, doing 1.6 perfection speedrun, clickbaiting the hell out of it. The, the title is also speed, uh, perfection speedrun once perfection drops, or once 1.6 drops. No. I am really bad at this whale right now. Have I? I have not gotten past whale. I'm too distracted by chat. It's fine. Bumbles, thank you for the 100 bits. Eh. Distracted by chat, honestly. Skill issue. A Jada, thank you for the 28. Thank you for the resub. And even after you just resub. <laughs> We need to pin a message saying that 1.6 is not out and we do not know the actual release time. Because <laughs> no one fucking knows it. I have insider info and I still don't even know it. Best resub day father FR on. I will be using the new farm, yes. <laughs> but thank you for the prime for... Five months. Time is it for me? 10.15. I am a central time zone. Andy. He tweeted. Did the man actually tweet about it? Did not, no. Okay. Well, you know, I'm relying on Twitch chat to tell me when the game can be updated, basically. And sometimes people just like to, uh, say shit. Oh, I thought I couldn't do that. When he wakes up, and I am assuming that he's not a degen like us, so his wake up time isn't that bad. <laughs> I'm so Let me rephrase that. I'm assuming he's not a degen like me and wakes up at a normal time. <laughs> when he's a programmer, he's also a very productive programmer. And if I were in his shoes, I would want to get the update out in the morning so I would have as much time to fix bugs and issues as possible when it releases. So, uh, yes, it should be early in the morning for him. And that is what I'm going off of, and I can- I feel like that is fine to assume. Unless he stays up late? Well, <laughs> I can confirm he... Well, I know. It wasn't up late. It was late for me. For him, I guess it was only 10. What is all the new things? I couldn't even tell you. Uh, like, yeah, let me just describe an update as large as 1.5 for you to tell you all the new things. I got you. I still, I still think the funnier part about all this 
Never mind, I'm not gonna actually say that. I'll debate you on that one. Say it? Nah. You guys seem super excited for a small modding update. Yeah. <laughs> small modding update, by the way. I, I'm new. Am I concerned, Dave? I would never impersonate him. It, it could be funny as a joke, yes, but I... No, I can't. No. Too much of a role model. To even do as a joke. They can't grow a beard like him. I don't want to grow a beard like him. Sorry, I'm not a fan of my facial hair. Well, I thank you for gifting a sub. I thought I hit that rock for a second, so I was gonna die. That great, that orange was impossible to get because of that rock, I think. The CA drink mayo. Okay, you wanna know why it says you can drink mayo? Because he probably didn't wanna add a specific mayo animation, so he just made the drinking animation a part of it. It's like how you eat plates in this game when you eat a dish. You didn't want to add specific eating animations, so you just made one that's universal where you throw it up in the air and fucking chug it. It's the exact same reason why we don't have like a- why we have a weird flower dance dance. Cause he didn't want to animate as much. It's pickles. Uh I wouldn't say he hates pickles. Pickles and Jelly got some love this update. For perfection? Uh, you don't even... Well, okay, you do need to marry a character, but it's only for the star drop, so you only have to marry one. If it wasn't for the star drop from being married, you wouldn't even need to marry a character. Probus gives you the star drop if you... Like, I count Krobus personally because it's literally the same thing as marriage, even though everybody calls it. It's a roommate. It's not marriage. Everybody acts like it's a fucking marriage. It's a marriage. The people are going like, does Krobus count fucking marry him every single time and just say, no, we're roomies. We're not married. But in, in the back of their mind, it's like, I'm only doing this because I want to fucking marry this guy. Let's be real, chat. You're not trying to just room with them. The 
This copy and paste is too long. On May 5th, the tight. What is this fucking copy pasta? Single shipment ever delivered to Mayo. I hate this run. I've missed so many fruits now. Oh, I need now. Updates out. Hoggies. First time chatter says updates out. Expecting me to believe it. The new farm type was already leaked by CA. It's called the Meadows Farm. It, you start with a coop and there's blue crunchy grass. Can we eat grass? No. Chewy. Chewy crunchy. I'm an idiot. I was trying to jump on that bubble and I didn't do it. Yo, did you infuse grass? Yeah. Are we here just to suffer? Can we smoke grass? No. We want another leak. He's also updated a few of the older farms that people don't really like. I won't say that they're good, but he's updated them. Did not make a boo sign at NDA. Nope. <laughs> I have no end NDA signed. And I could leak a whole lot more, but I have respect for him. I think it's a little fun teasing saying things that aren't <laughs> that aren't very descriptive, but at the same time gets people fucking riled up. <laughs> Uh, non-disclosure agreement. If he invites me to the Haunter Chocolatier beta, he better make me sign one. <laughs> I'm gonna present him one. <laughs> if, he's, if he's like, yo, here, you wanna play the beta for this? I'm like, give me an NDA, please. <laughs> give me an NDA. What got leaked? I've uh, been slowly leaking random things that really don't mean anything. Very inconsequential stuff. Chat, what's the biggest leak I've given you? That's that fucking jump. Iridium Scythe? I didn't even tell you what it did. I did not tell you the festival.
You can drink mayo. Yeah. Yeah, you already knew that the Iridium Scythe was an item, and I just said it was an interesting item. That 1.6 is as large as 1.5? Yeah, that's probably it. That is probably true. Iridium Scythe is the biggest leak. All right. Let's put it this way. When I say the Iridium Scythe is interesting, it is the first thing I'm going for. <laughs> Let's just put it like that. Iridium Scythe marriage candidates, yes. Take that as you will. No one knows. Read the pen. Actually, what does the pen even say? I know it says it's not out, but I can't say the full thing. Iridium Scythe can now kill villagers. When did I demo? Uh, what day is it? March 19th? Um, actually, that's something I won't leak. 1.6 is not out yet. We're playing Junimo Kart in the meantime. Thank you, Lee Chat. Yeah, delayed. That's something I won't leak. Alright, I've given you guys too much now. We gotta we gotta rain it back, rain it back. Mayo juice. <laughs> Uh, could be true, could be false. Gotta always be ready. While sucking at Junimo Kart. Tell us exactly how the CC route will change. Cord, good news. It might be faster on current patch because new hotkeys go burr. I don't know about route wise, but new hotkeys go burr. I've already leaked that, so I don't care. I'm not convinced yet, yeah. I'm will ha uh, I'm gonna have the time, uh how much time is lost to the new cutscenes. Cause that's kinda the main thing. Plus, well, if I'm, like, completely misunderstanding how legacy RNG works.
Imagine if Mumu didn't have insider info and is just trolling. <laughs> it would be funny if I did that, but then I would have to be making up a lot of shit. Because I've mentioned stuff that is not a part of any of the patch notes yet. Or any of the released info. I think if I didn't mention the map updates... I probably could have gotten away with everything I said. Right? Because that was the only item I've commented on or only change I've commented on that is not public knowledge. Change is a bad word. Uh, like they, he gave it. They, he gave them some love. I won't say it was very good love. You know, it's like, it's like when you hug a dog and it gives you that stink eye. Like I don't really want to be touched right now, but I'm going to accept your love. It's like that type of love. You know. Wait, how did I get hit by that? It's not like unconditional love, but it's like it, it got a, it got a little bit of love to make them less worse, but still worse. Now see as the dog, <laughs> giving the map or giving the human map a. <laughs> The, the update. Am I gonna read the patch notes? No, I don't need to. I'll let you guys do that. I just want to get into running. And I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest, chat. I really didn't play that much of it. I mostly just read the patch notes about the changes and formed my conclusions based off of that. A lot of the 1.6 stuff that I will be doing is first time experience, and the reason for that is because I didn't want to ruin my mus mu muscle memory of 1.5, and I didn't want to just randomly leak info to you guys when I was playing. Could you imagine me trying to use a hotkey of 1.6 that I got myself used to on 1.5 and then have to play it off like, oh man, <laughs> I, I, I just had a brain fart. Why the fuck did I do that? Yeah, it just wouldn't look good. So I didn't really play much of it. I just read a lot. I don't want any spoilers, then I wouldn't recommend watching the stream when 1.6 drops because I'm going to need to be playing through it very quickly. Stop lying, streamer. You are illiterate. Yes. Thank you. Must be drinking a triple shot espresso. He might. Has clay farming got patched? Yes and no. It got patched if you use regular RNG. It's not patched if you use legacy. So you can still do it, but you have to use a very you have to use a specific setting to do it.
Uh, so I could lose some people their careers about saying one thing, and I will say it as soon as the update drops. <laughs> it's so sad. It's so sad. You don't seem sad about it because it doesn't change any any form of my playstyle whatsoever. <laughs> Who career? Well, I mean, CA ruined their career, not me. Is a changing game. One point six party popper party popper. Yes, as far as I'm aware, that is a setting legacy RNG. Basically, he made the game more random in this update. Okay, just because everybody has literally said it already, yes, T Sapling's got nerfed. Rip Lizard. 07s. Somebody should uh, wake them up and tell them to sell all their reserves right now. Is clay farming nerfed? Yes and no. Clay farming, again, can't be done if you don't select the legacy RNG. Again, the randomness was changed. If you want to know what the nerf is, I think it's just a sell price cut. I can't remember if it's halved or what it is. But it was pretty killed. Will Legacy be used in runs and speed runs? Yes. In the run that I'm doing today, no. I don't really want to clay farm and I want to try the new uh, RNG. Uh, I will not finish today. Let me be let me be very clear about this. I will not finish this run in a single day. You guys have the YouTube videos where I finish this run in 20 hours or whatever. I think this patch will literally make the perfection speedrun, like, you can't even do it in under a day until it's extremely optimized. Like, that's how much time it's going to add. There's so- there's a lot of new shit. And some of the most expensive crafting recipes CA has ever added. Expensive? Expensive <laughs> is not in the terms of it will take long to get the resources. Expensive in, like, the amount of raw resources you need is much higher than what people are used to. This door is like a leaking screen door on a submarine, of course. Wait, how do you think we're gonna get viewers, Court? I gotta I gotta I gotta milk the view count before the before 1.6 comes. I was doing a really good job at restraining myself and now I'm kinda just like dropping shit way too much. Yeah, we do need some flex seal. I'm gonna, I might keep my old farm. I want it, start new. De definitely start new, it'll be a better experience. Trust on that one. You should start a new farm for 1.6.
a changed title. I thought about doing that, but I thought it would be too fucking, uh... <laughs> too bad. I didn't think I would leak this much. But I guess that's me. That's who I am. I hate that bubble. It made me miss that grape. Uh, I don't recommend playing with mods in Stardew in the first place, so, uh, yes, disable mods. They will be updated very quickly after release, but... I think Vanilla 1.6 is more content to warrant an entire playthrough than saying, Oh man, the game doesn't have enough content, I'm gonna play with mods. How did I not jump there? But will Smappy work? It's already updated. You wanna know, this is a this is a modding leak more so than anything. You could uh there's the patch notes for 1.6's uh modding changes has been out for like months so far. And it's been public to like anybody in the modding scene. And CA made a reminder or or Pathos, I believe, made a reminder post to them. Saying, hey, if you haven't, 1.6 is around the corner, you can update your mods. And the, the the Discord just, like, fucking lost their shit. Like, oh, man, I can't update my mod in time. They literally had access to this for literal, for literal months now. And people just don't know. So, basically, any high-end mod, mod or commonly used mod is going to be updated as soon as 1.6 drops. If not already updated, if you probably go to their st or if you go to the page, I like the default graphics of the game, so uh, personally not. But if you don't like the default graphics, I understand that pasty yellow dirt can be very distracting sometimes. Or saturated, not pasty. Not getting that orange. Much as I would like to. So many people are watching on YouTube and Twitch because they figured out that I was fucking leaking shit. So they want to hear the leaks. <laughs> Do I know the difference? Uh, one is actually like more true RNG. So, uh, what's a good example of this? So, if you've ever seen me do a community center speedrun and have noticed when I break barrels, there is a set pattern to them and I can always tell you where the club is. I actually don't... Ugh, fuck. This one might not actually be changed, but it's just an example. Uh, it's like that, that RNG is like predetermined. It looks random and it changes daily, but it's not truly random. When you when you know it, it's it, that's not even sea based though. That's day base. Uh, I mean clay farming is the easiest example, I guess. Like clay farming, it looks random when you till dirt and you get clay. I couldn't jump because of that boulder. Uh, it looks random, but you can get clay every single hoe. That won't work anymore, because now it's like an actual like percent chance of getting clay while tilling from a spot. So instead of it like, yeah, and instead of it being a pattern, it's actually random. So if you just till a line of dirt, you have a set chance of getting like four clays in a row. Instead of uh, none, 
is how it used to work because it, it was a set pattern. Legacy RNG changes that back, but... Uh, I'm pretty sure Step Manip is entirely past rain. RNG is now random. Mega Crops will also be random, I think. Something I could be wrong against. I can't tell you one for one what the RNG changes exactly affect because I know some stuff isn't. Blade is very much aware that his predictor will be broken. I cannot... Yeah, I know stuff, but I do not... Like, I can leak information. I know insider information, yes. But I cannot tell you the actual release date of 1.6. If I knew the actual release date... Or, not release date. Release time of 1.6, I would be... I would start stream 10 minutes beforehand. I'll have you know. But since I'm not, now I'm playing Junmo Kart waiting because I do not know that info. No one knows that info besides CA, Pathos, and May and uh what his other developers. We know the release date, not release time. They might know. Yeah. Oh, I can't drop down that? Okay. While CA is still sleeping. He is definitely not sleeping, and I can tell you that. CA <laughs> watching in stream right now, seeing me expose more info so he gets his ass online so I can't expose as much. Will there be a 1.7? I don't think he said it's not that it won't ever happen, but he's definitely going to release a Haunted Chocolatier before 1.7. As a person, it, as just a normal person, I I would find it very hard to believe that CA doesn't know who the release time he's aiming for. Maybe he doesn't hit it, but he will at least have in his mind, yeah, I want to release it in the next hour or so. And maybe has like a an hour like picked out already. Uh, hopefully mobile for 1.6 comes out faster because there's less to port over. Because they had to remake the entire mobile port from scratch, and that was the reason 1.5 took so long. And then, uh, he kept having team, like, team, like, he kept hiring the, uh, companies that just kept failing at it. So it took longer. This is, like, the, my general assumption based off of how development generally works. Because he went through multiple teams, as far as I know. So it's like, they just kept, didn't working out, and they had to rebuild it from the ground up. So it's just like a mess of having to rebuild it from the ground up and teams not doing a good enough job on it constantly. So it ended up taking way longer than he would have liked. Which sucks. I would guess... Switch probably gets the next release of 1.6 first. The Switch is generally the fastest one to be updated because Nintendo's policies are a lot better than Microsoft and Sony's. And then, uh, obviously, Microsoft Sony will ideally go up at the same time. Um, depends on if one of their stores says no. Because I think I mentioned this in a, uh, a stream a bit ago, but if you gotta, you gotta get your 
uh, game approved uh, uh, to go on, I believe, the, the Microsoft Store. So, uh, on the Microsoft Store, if your game crashes during one of the stability tests at all, you have to redo the entire uh, thing. Like, you have to resubmit it and go through the entire process again. If your game crashes once during that, doesn't matter what cause it is. So that's why consoles can take longer sometimes because of that. Yeah. For quality insurance, which obviously you don't ever really want your game to crash, but you know, if, if you know anything about programming, sometimes things are very dumb. That's why uh, the console stores generally take a bit longer. No, it doesn't depend. If it crashes for whatever reason, they have to go through the entire process again. Nah, I'm good. The reason I haven't streamed the past four days is because I got burnt out of Community Center. And I'm going to be doing it again here for perfection. I'm probably going to do the Community Center on the on Remix bundles for uh, this perfection speedrun just for fun. I heard that there were some... Uh, er, well, not heard. I know that there's some new Remix bundles and I want to see them. I don't know how good or bad they will be, but I do want to see them. I think it would be interesting. There are tasks? Yes, there is. There is a 1.5 task on speedrun.com by... Or not speedrun.com. On YouTube by underscore. He's done a few task videos. Same with Blade. I don't know what the bundles are. No. I know there are new ones. I have no idea what items they are. Again, I did not really play that much of the 1.6 update because I didn't want to leak anything very early and I didn't want to ruin my muscle memory. But I do know that there are new ones. Again, most of the new playthrough will be blind other than a few tidbits. And to be quite honest, I would know these tidbits going into the update because I would have just done what I did with 1.5 and read the patch notes before I actually started playing. So basically, me knowing the 1.6 info right now is just me knowing the patch notes before we actually play. That's it. I like my knowledge doesn't go more than just patch notes info. Those boulders were like really mean place. Babu rolls no new bundles. I would laugh. Yeah. Are we finally gonna get our first loop an hour into fucking Genomo carding? Or am I gonna fail and die on last stage? Only it took an hour to loop. Yes, I plan on playing New Farm. New Farm, no fun. I plan on doing all the new stuff I can in the settings. I think it'll just be more fun that way. Like, I'm putting Speedrun in the title kind of more for clickbait in a lot of ways, just because people know me as the speedrunning guy. And in reality, it's more of, like, casual first playthrough, but I'm skipping a lot of the boring shit with Speedrun stuff. The goal is to be the first person to complete perfection, though, on 1.6 from a new file. That is the goal. That said, it will be slower. Th like, if somebody, if one of the other, like, speedrunners just was like, you know what, I want to fuck with Habu and be, and just be the first person to uh, get perfection, uh, they could just play on all the fastest settings and probably beat me. I'm well aware of that. 
but that's the goal. One stream? Nah. I doubt anybody will actually do 24 hours to actually do it. Best as fuck, boy. Unlucky. Can I get under that ghost? I didn't. Samantha? Yeah. Samantha, start streaming right away and beat it. Stream for 24 hours straight. Abu doing the festivals? I would... I mean, I'm gonna go to the new festival, obviously. I also have the perfection task is expanded no well okay i'll wait i'll wait to comment more on this i'll wait nah i'll wait until patch drops i'll i'll explain it when uh when it happens there's there's a lot of uh technicalities here of what I'm what I'm doing. There's a lot of technicalities. So there it's like I I I don't want to explain stuff. Any thoughts on new farm? Shit. Will mean nothing. You ha your NDA has lifted now. It has definitely not. I've definitely never, s never uh, signed an NDA. Bro, it's completely useless. Completely useless for community center. It's a cool farm, all right? Yeah, like I said it at the start. And this is not even like leaked info. Starting with a coop is not nearly as good as you think it is. Starting with a coop is generally, honestly, detrimental because then it's gonna make you wanna think, oh man, I gotta put money into my animals to grow them up when you're just better off putting money into fucking crops. It's actually garbage in that regards. Friendship with animals really doesn't mean a lot when the animals don't make any, make realistically any good profit to begin with. I hope your ducks trolled me today. Thank you. I gotta go to the bathroom, so I'll be right back. I'm gonna leave you on the Genoma Cart screen. Ugh. Honestly, yeah. The best idea to do with the coop is sell the chicken day one. That's probably a lie. It's actually okay to just let them out and let them graze, pet them daily, and then sell it when it has more hearts. But it's still probably a good idea in some challenge runs to literally just sell the fucking uh, chicken right off the start. Right off rip for the money. That's how bad it is.
Apparently, apparently. Apparently the main Discord is uh, panicking right now that CA is now online. Not mobile. <laughs> Don't panic. <laughs> He's literally on Discord mobile, by the way. So if I understand you correctly regarding 1.6 meadow farm with aged blueberry wine focus for max profits, yes. Yes. No. No, Jada. Wolf, thank you for the tier one. New farm is the greatest thing. Yeah. I do think it is probably the new prettiest farm. Don't get me wrong. I think aesthetic, uh, aesthetic designers are going to absolutely love the new farm. Absolutely love the new farm. But it's not going to be good for speedrunning. Well, I mean, it, it's, yeah, it's not going to be good for speedrunning, but it could be very interesting for challenge runs that just need a coop for whatever reason. E. Uh. Fiona, Sky, Gypsy, thank you for the 49 months. And Bugs World, thank you for the 16. And Need You, thank you for the 5 gifted. I'm in your backpack, thank you for the 13 as well. VA is typing in Discord. You guys are desperate. It has been. Animal only challenge, yeah. Panic? I don't know. I'm waiting for people to tell me. How does the new farm look? Very meadowy. Yes, it has an official Discord, Jada. B day Kappa, thank you for the tier one for 51 months as well. One point six out yet. Read pen. Yeah, 1.6 came out, and the first thing I decided to do was play Junimo Kart instead of 1.6. Ah, uh, yes. The, the, the class with this one. 
Who fucking cares about 1.6 when you can play Junimo Kart? Absolutely based. Uh, like an hour or two. Depends on what CA says, because apparently he was typing in the Stardew Valley main discord. I'm curious to see what he would say, or what he said. How much do I play casually? I don't. I have, like, what did, what did I have? 5,800 hours in this game, and I want to say... Uh, about 5,400 of those hours are probably streamed. Doing speedruns and challenge runs. The only stuff that has not been streamed is, like, whatever random YouTube recordings I've done. My one original playthrough before I started streaming this game. And speedrunning this game. And then whatever, like, random side things I've done for YouTube. That's it. Just those things. And, like, I guess route planning occasionally. If I need to do a live demo. I can't play casually. Like, to a casual... Like, to a standard person's definition, my cas... Or, like, my quote-unquote casual is still very try-hard and just, like, sweaty. Like, the, to put it in perspective, what I'm going to be doing today in today's stream when 1.6 comes out is my casual. Like, this is probably the one of the most casual streams you will see from me in terms of, like, playing Stardew. So if you want to see me play casually, yes, today is basically the day. It will not be casual. How did I miss that jump? Holy shit. It will not be casual to people's point of view. And the reason for that is strictly because, again, that's a lot of fucking hours. Almost 6k hours, and over 5,000 of that has either been speedrunning or challenge running. There's no casual playing. My brain is hardwired to just do the general most optimal thing. Or like a general more efficient way than being like, oh, I want to I wanna grow poppies this summer. I want to grow some flowers. I want to do some beehives instead of ancient wine, starfruit wine, pumpkin, pickled pumpkins. Let's go scam Pierre while we're at it with the with the exploit. Oh, what about what about animation canceling? Like, if I get a good luck day on the fifth here, when playing this game, if I get a good luck day on the fifth, I'm going to be level forty in the mines on day five. Let's be real here. The uh, animation canceling is still in the game. He won't patch animation canceling. I can already tell you that right now. Animation canceling is not patched. Clay farming's patched. And he nerfed fucking tea saplings. We still got animation canceling. Oh, you want to know what an even funnier thing is to piss off even more casuals here? He's nerfing the already worse option, the Mushroom Cave. Bat Cave superiority, but he's nerfing the Mushroom Cave. Cack. Why? Because it's bugged. It's bugged that it's producing every single day, so it produces every other day, so it's, its efficiency is literally cut in half. <laughs> it, 
It's half as bad now. <laughs> I've mentioned this already on stream, but that's it's just funny. Is that a joke? No, I'm dead serious. He's nerfing tea saplings. You're joking. I have an at. I'm kind of concerned. I'm less concerned now. Give me a second. Now I gotta go through all the fucking patch notes. Where's the exact nerf? Nerf. Yeah, it's a nerf. I'm not, I, I, you know, I was going to screenshot it, but I'm just going to leave it as is. He's nerfing the tea sapling sell price, but he's buffing tea leaves in exchange. I was fact checking what the sell price was changed to, so I can say it upon release. I'm not going to leak. At, I'm not going to re. I'm not going to leak specific info like that in terms of like the actual numbers. know what it does so I can't say without leaking it and I won't leak that <laughs> you know just because you're so spot on I'll give that to you uh yeah that's one of the buffs <laughs> bando that is one of the buffs I'll give that one to you Tea saplings do get a, or not tea saplings, tea leaves give a move speed buff when you eat them now. I think it also applies, I'm not going to go and check the patch notes, but I think it also applies to uh, the tea, yes. I know, I, I literally saw it when I was looking for the tea sapling nerf when I was uh, hotkey searching for it, and I saw the compensating buff for it, and I saw the move speed buff already. So I'd assume it applies to everything. Where patch notes? Uh, I'm leaking stuff. There are no patch notes. I would have to reread it. it. I may have misread just green tea as, gr as tea leaves, but it's something about the tea itself gives you move speed. I saw that. That's all I'll give. I feel like mayo being drinkable now has put a divide in the community. You have half the people joking about the fact that you can drink mayo and then the other half who are mayo haters just saying, I hope, I hope mayo gives you negative energy. 
very polarizing here, guys. Very polar polarizing. Dancing for the 22 months. Is new farm type? No, it sucks for CC. Well, okay. Let me rephrase this. It has, it has a very big potential in terms of the fact that if we can start it or if we can run it, you can skip an entire upgrade day at Robin's, which should in theory save us about three minutes because uh, we, we wouldn't have to do it. The issue is, is then we skip out on the cheapest upgrade, so we still have to make a majority of the money. But, uh, I don't know how we get purple mushrooms consistently. The, the, the biggest issue is always just how do we get purple mushrooms? You're not going to get it from the mines. You're not YOLOing it from the mines. It takes too long. We only get to 55. So the new farm type would have to give mushrooms, which I don't think it does. Or it's just not practical. You can do it with solar? Yeah, but you still need a purple mushroom for the community center. How good is it space-wise? I think it's the worst farming map in the game. I think it has less spots than the forest farm. Don't quote me on that. The new farm. I count. I no beach has the most tillable spots. You just can't sprinkle or them them. Worst farm. Yeah, that's what I said. Uh, no, the new, I don't think the new map is designed for eight players. No. I thought he went back on that at one point. I know, I know I mentioned that he was planning for it eight players, but I also thought he went back on it at one point. And then he improved the netcode, so he may have went back to it. I don't know if he said anything official about it. Eight players might be like a default option now where you don't have to like enable it, but none of the maps are designed for eight people. Oh, I've already confirmed that. That that was something that's something that if you're a modder you could figure out because uh uh if you if you're in the modding space for Stardew, like they have the modding patch notes already. They've had it for months. They could see the updates slowly turn out and see improvements and that like Tyler said to me specifically there has been attempts to improve the net code he doesn't know how successful they are but he said there there has been attempts <laughs> at the very least or changes I should say changes would probably be a better word well see how successful they are I'm still gonna assume if you are somebody in the US and you're trying to play with somebody from Europe or specifically New Zealand you're still not going to have a very fun time but if you live in the same house it should be much better <laughs> or you know, honestly even same continent it should be much better grip blade oh sevens to blade oh yeah chigarito with <laughs> Japan I'm the the only thing, if if any changes are fixed with the netcode, I just hope there's less loading screen of deaths in the mines. That's like the best change or the best fix that we could get. Vietnam now? Okay. I remember you being in Japan at one point. I, yeah, I didn't realize you moved, but it'd be like that. Wow, 
will I be testing clay farm? I do not need to test it because I know that uh, there's a setting that basically removes clay farming and there's a setting that allows you to do it, which will be legacy RNG setting in the advanced options. CA so yeah, is changing a lot of how the RNG works in this game, this patch, uh, but because speedrunning asked him to, his speedrunners basically asked him to, he gave us a option to keep the old RNG in the terms of legacy RNG. Because we abuse a lot of RNG in the runs. And if he completely removed that, it would really kill a lot of times or make them impossible to reach. So uh, he gave us uh, in between. Because it's like, we want to play on the new update. Like we really do want to play on the new update. But it's like some changes can really just screw us. And that's the issue. So he's trying to give us like as close to a middle ground as possible to give us the highest possible chance. As achieving perfection, there's new craftable items. So yes, new craftables, new cooking, new everything. Any new craftable item I'm gonna have to craft for all, uh, for crafting everything. Uh, I hope it does. I can't 100% say if it does. Because again, I haven't tested that. That's something I would have to ask Blade. Do you think categories will be 1.6 RNG? Yes, actually. I think all mines categories will be theoretically fastest on 1.6. So, uh, if anybody has seen my speedruns long enough and I have explained it. Legacy RNG does not affect traveling cart. Well, then never mind. We're fucked. CC will probably be forever on 1.5 then. Yes. Uh, ladders spawn in a diagonal pattern. Or like in like patterns basically. So if you have a, area, a ladder in one area. Like you can predict where the ladders will just about be on every other floor. So sometimes the RNG makes it where you can't get ladders from like the first few rocks of the floor. Just, just based off of ladder positioning. On the new update with leg or with the new RNG implemented, in theory, you have a flat chance of getting a ladder every single rock you break. So you can just monkey brain the mines now. It's a completely randomized mines. So it makes it so you can monkey brain and just get ladder for a swing every time and there's no like thing about it. Any new crops? He's already leaked a new crop, I thought. I can't even tell you what it is, but there is a new crop icon, I'm pretty sure. Leaked at one point. Oh, wait. Lizard, how long have you been here? Did you, uh, I feel like I should tell you this just because, uh, somebody should tell you. Uh,. How many tea saplings have you not sold on your billion tea farm yet? Might want to go sell those. Might want to go sell those. They nerfed the sell price of tea saplings, but they buffed everything else revolving tea. Tea leaves are better, and green tea is better. Love you. But yes, tea saplings have been nerfed. Oh sevens. Patch notes are not public, but I know them because insider info. I have not... I have loaded up 1.6 once. That's all I will say. Just to test a few things. But I didn't want to ruin my muscle memory or leak anything way too early. So I decided to just restrain myself to reading patch notes. 
So a majority of what I will be playing on stream today is blind other than reading patch notes early. And to be quite honest, I would have just read the patch notes before I started playing 1.6. So it actually works out quite well for me. How did I miss that jump? Also, Tora, thank you for the resub. And, oh god, there was a lot of subs I missed when I was ranting. They gave an estimated time. What was that estimated time? I haven't read it. The new RNG getting requested? Actually, no. He was doing that himself. The request was to allow us to have legacy RNG. It was going to be in an hour. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. How long? Uh, Probably a week or two would be my guess for console editions. Mobile? No idea. <laughs> Could be a month. Bubble is going to be the slowest, would be my guess, again. Mobile has Ginger Island. Yes, it's had it for a while. Uh, I actually think Switch will be the fastest of the three consoles. I think Microsoft will be the slowest of the three. Uh, not much. Stardew Valley is not a very big game. What was the world record? Uh, I have very dated info on it, but last I checked, it's over. I think it's over 400,000. I couldn't tell you exact number. The record for Junimo, or for the highest Junimo cart uh, endless score is like over 400,000. It's like doubled mine. Uh, I will not give specifics to tell the patch note or the patch is released. I will not give specific numbers like that. I'm fine leaking, like, random shit that's kind of, like, funny things. Like, CA was basically leaking the last few days, but I won't leak it. I, I won't leak in numbers. Uh, I think they will be, yes. They'll at least be compatible. I don't know if they'll have any changes. Actually, they might. They're pretty, they're pretty involved in the modding space. So they probably had beta access as well has made changes accordingly. Leak who has the best winter outfit? I haven't played that much. I'll have you know. I, I don't even know what any... Other than the ones that have been leaked on the posters, I actually do not know what the winter outfits look like. New farm for speedruns? It might be interesting... Would it? No, you can't even make complete breakfast without milk. I was going to say it might be interesting for Alex speedruns, but I can't think of anything else. Useless for mines, useless for community center. Uh... It would have to be marriage. Money for two chickens. Well, mine's 120 is permanently stuck on 1.4.0 because of explosive ammo, and mine's 50 doesn't need the money. So it's useless for both of the mines. Uh, Skull Cavern's 100. No, that needs explosive ammo. It's worthless. It would have to be a marriage category.
It would specifically have to be a marriage category. Is the only time the farm type would be used. No. Community center is going to be probably permanently at 1.5.6, unfortunately. Here's uh here's the reason why. At one at one point five point six, the traveling cart has very weird or it's like prior to one point six, RNG is uh being changed, right? One point six is changing RNG. One of that RNG is the traveling cart. The traveling cart worked in a weird way before where uh the items that were not allowed to show up in the traveling cart would make the item that is next in the ID chain or whatever more likely to appear. At least this is my understanding of it. And it just so happens that Pufferfish, a very, a very hard fish to catch early, is right before a very long line of that. So the Pufferfish has a 37.5% chance of showing up in a cart, or in, in the traveling cart every Friday and Saturday at 1.5.6. This is gone on 1.6. Legacy RNG does not even change that back. So you would have to get your puffer fish the normal way or get lucky with a 2% chance essentially. So realistically on average, the puffer fish will probably lose about a minute if you're lucky. Just by default. Because of that change. There's a 2% chance. If you get extremely lucky, yes. It could in theory be better. If your tuna is shit in summer, you can catch the puffer fish along with it. Smile. But yeah, that's kind of the the dilemma. And then you can't use the new farm because mushrooms. Mushrooms is kind of uh hard to work with. Cuz it's like even if you take the mushroom cave, then you're kind of screwed on artisan goods is the issue. So you kind of forced to take back cave. The nerf won't affect speed running, so we don't care. Red cabbage, 2%. No need to hibernate. Yeah. Leak the new fish. I don't even know the new fish off the top of my head. Nope. I think uh, people said on the official Discord CA side, like, the plan is like an hour or so from now. So, uh, whatever the next hour time frame is. 12, 12.30. Keep in mind, that's what people said. That has been said. I have not gone to check myself, but that is what people have said to me. Hopefully. Can you do clay farming? No. Capital D column from piano, but kind of happy clay farming's being removed. Not fun. It's not even being removed entirely, so it's kind of just one of those things. It can still be done. Yes. Hunter's Chocolatier will probably become my main game as soon as it's released. Yeah, it's a part of the RNG change with Legacy. It was exploiting RNG, so... 
Uh, basically, anything that was exploiting RNG is going to be removed. Oh, I was looking for reading chat. Uh, I don't think CA will be releasing any more info until the patch is dropped. Uh, other than, like, more specific time frame. Useless, basically. Uh, I think he's updating it, so it will still have some use, but it will be much worse. Yes. Oh, worse in quotes of less effective. Are you going to be completely different? Uh... Yes and no. Depends on your play style. I don't know if there's new achievements. What time is released? People said, CA said in the Discord like an hour or so. I don't know how long ago it's been. Yeah, I actually said that. That's what people told me. I do not know, though. I've basically been saying an hour or so for the past uh, two hours, so. You know, chat, I woke up early for me today. Now, don't flame me too hard because my sleep schedule is absolute dog shit, but I woke up at 8 today. And I could have just slept into my normal time and still be streaming. Or I could have just streamed normally. <laughs> and I wouldn't have been late. I was so paranoid about being late today. Because I was sleeping when 1.5 dropped and I didn't want it to happen again. It has not said anything. Unlucky. I woke up to several DMs about, hey, 1.5 dropped. I was like, huh, what? Huh? Uh, I do not. Yes. I'll do it over the course of a few days like normal, but I'm not gonna do it all in one day. As much as I'm excited for 1.6, I do enjoy <laughs> not torturing myself and playing 12 hours of video games and taking breaks. How many times do I reach perfection? How many marriageable candidates are in this game? Well, around that. Back to Discord. game just crashed why is it doing this bro i can't even oh, there we go. this patch come out though now streamer one is 1.7 coming out though now Oh, 
Unlucky. Did I not die from that? How did I miss that grape as well? What update was my favorite? Uh, probably 1.5, yes. Waiting, we're all waiting, yes. There's so many people clickbaiting 1.6 being out, you should join them. No, I'm not gonna clickbait waiting. We're not gonna clickbait saying that 1.6 is out. for the 64. Flip it, he said it's out, yes. Think there's ever gonna be another Stardew Cup? I hope. I have read the thing. And not as much has been said as people think. I have started to refrain. A lot of it was, uh... A lot of it was more exp Not really even expanding, but uh, a lot of uh, the modding changes. And speedrunner talks. I will respect the wishes. Card user, I don't know. I don't play this game with mods very often. Not a huge mod fan. It's always so ironic, or so like, ironic when I say I don't like playing with mods even though I develop two different mods or help develop two different mods. Oh shit. But mods, uh, I helped remake the Battle Royale mod. 
uh, for 1.5, and then I also helped make the roguelike mod. And then there is a few more in progress, but... I will not be commenting anymore on 1.6. Other than confirmed features. Your ship drops to zero based. Yes, it's no NDA, but it is bad taste. Do I personally believe what I have said has been egregious? No. I think only like one or two things were like actually bad, but a lot of the other th other things have just been like reconfirming or talking about speedrunning stuff that has already been confirmed via like other sources outside of uh, speedrunning or outside of uh, confirmed posts. And what I mean by that is, if you're in the modding Discord, you could see a lot of the changes that I've mentioned. All the RNG stuff is in the modding Discord, because that was a part of uh, the modding stuff. And then netcode shenanigans is modding stuff. Com completely different than uh, the actual new stuff. Uh, that, not commenting. Yeah, update will come up when CA is ready. Why is everybody just so stuck? <laughs> Why is everybody so stuck on being able to eat mayonnaise? I get told off? No, nah, I didn't get told off. Necessarily. Stream. Oh no, I just all tab. Had to get a snack, yes.
What got me into speedrunning? I was just interested in speedrunning in general. And then I played Stardew. Uh, just casually for the first time. And I enjoyed I enjoyed it. I'm just like, I wonder if I could speedrun Stardew. I looked it up. There is a few speedruns already. And then I did a Mines 50 run. For a while, I was like off and on running it. For quite a while. And then... I forget when, but then I started doing... I, I, it was after Tushi did his first money challenge run. I'm like, I can do that. So I started doing money challenge runs for a while. And that's when I started streaming Stardew more consistently. What speedrun am I the most proud of? Oh, easily CC. She runs the hardest prepare for. Oh, easily perfection. It's just so much. Yeah, the updates today. Yes, I will be doing new farm, new settings, remix bundles. Whatever. How many push-ups can I do? Uh, at least 10. And no, I'm not gonna set up the camera to do that. There's not really much to push up. Kinda. Light. Am I gonna marry? Don't know. I'll figure that out later. Thank you for the tier one. How many days? Uh, it depends on how long I go for. I don't know how long it will actually take. Best quality of life change Stardew has had, in my opinion, being able to buy 25 from a stack. Being able to buy 25 at a time from Pierre's shop. Or being able to press E while holding an item to put it into your first inventory slot. Or pressing tab to be able to swi switch between your backpack spaces. But that was like an update a while ago and that was always on consoles and it wasn't always on PC for a while which is kind of funny yeah tab is super nice you think it was default in the game but it used to not be in the game prior to 1.4 I think it was added at 1.4 which is kind of gross
Jada, was the was the concert good? Tyler said he enjoyed it as well. He really liked the mines aspect of it because it felt like a chord stream. Smile. He did have a, a good pace run yesterday, though. Too many, uh... Too much ending shit, but that's how CC runs go occasionally. What, V? You smell. Don't you have a fight to break up? Not anymore. That's so shitty. That <laughs> you have to say not anymore. Uh... That's about my pace. Maybe 30 seconds ahead. I think I think I have a uh the fall 14th end is at like two hours thirty seconds or something like that. Yes, that is the goal. I will. I mean, I was hoping 1.6 would drop maybe a little bit sooner, but. Oh, well. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna end stream as soon as 1.6 drops and play it, but I'm gonna play it without streaming it. No one has ever restarted the run. drink mayo any percent <laughs> people are really <laughs> how many times am i gonna say this people are like really focused no, that's unfortunate on the fucking being able to drink mayo i don't even think it's the mayo part anymore i think it's the fact that it says drink and that's what uh, that's what got people hung up about it is the drinking part. It's not even the... It's not even the fucking eating part. Uh, I'm gonna get... Uh, I'm probably gonna take Yogi instead of a cat, but I'm gonna take the dog just so I can put the hat on him. Yes. Drink mayo percent. I would probably throw up if you had me eat a fucking spoonful of mayo. Uh, I think technically Samantha does.
I don't really think about the new farm type. I having a coop at the beginning as a head start. I kind of don't want that. Uh, I think it's less impactful than people think. How difficult. The first time it took me... Uh, how many hours did it take me? It took me quite a few hours to do it the first time. Now I could do it pretty consistently. Yeah, you can also cheese it. I'll never stoop that low, but you can cheese it. Uh, for this perfection run, I'm going to do all the new settings. Yes. That's the plan. I don't know how the <laughs> the achievement works. So there's a not achievement. Uh, you know the little uh, quest where it's like build a coop. You know I don't know how that's gonna work on the new farm. Gonna, is it gonna tell you to grow more crops? That achievement kind of is weird. No, that's interesting. Build a barn. <laughs> Gotta build another coop. Quest, will you give me egg? You should definitely have an egg by then. Upgrade coop. I feel like upgrading a coop is much harder than uh, building it. That's like a uh, 14,000 gold difference. No? Build a second coop anyways. Do you really though? Uh, don't know. I feel like CA is a mayo enjoyer, so it's probably just the normal. You probably just get energy. How long did it take? Uh, I don't really know. I just play the game. Wouldn't necessarily say that long, but. Plus five speed of luck. Yeah, Mayo gets the same stats as Magic Rock Candy. You say Mayo enjoyer like it's a bad thing. I've already said my stance on Mayo. Not a fan. You're entitled to enjoy what you want. Obviously. Duck mayo drinkable. I would assume it includes all mayo. But I am unsure. Need dino nuggies for dino mayo. <laughs> I 
Dang, that Void Egg minus his HP. I wouldn't be surprised if, uh... Wait, no, does Void Egg minus HP? I thought one of the eggs minus his HP. I can't eat the dino one. Oh, you can already eat void mayo? Wait, why could you eat void mayo and not any of the other mayo? Is that actually a thing? It's Tyler's mom. Why do you like why do you like to bring up Tyler's mom all the time, V? What'd she do to you? He's not even here to defend himself. That hits. I wanted the cherry, though. <laughs> what happened during the process? I mean, there. I guess there are some things like that. Like table salt, you know? It's like two very deadly chemicals, but when you combine them together, it's fine. for the tier one. Don't know. If I knew, I would have. I wouldn't be playing Junmo card and would have just started stream right when uh, 1.6 dropped. Stream two and a half hours. <laughs> I don't want to go get food. Probably take a break and just get food real quick. So I, I'm not like hungry right into stream or right into the update. I thought it would drop earlier. It's so sad. Thank you for the your one for six or for nine months. Hey, secretly watching, waiting for you to go eat to drop it. Yes. Go 
go eat. How did I miss that cherry? Go eat, have. Prefer it all. I don't prefer it all today. I don't think I have. I'll do prefer it all first, actually. Uh... It's probably scorpion carp. Any season, any weather, any time, and it's not one of those two fish. And it did that. I refuse to believe that it was one of the legendaries. Uh, I can't. It, well, I mean, it would have to be mutant carp. I refuse to believe that that's a mutant carp. Stingray, Stingray doesn't do that. You'd see, it needs to be any time. Or any season, any time. Uh, it, it has to be, uh, it would be Mutant Carp. I'm trying to think of other darts that do that. I guess Dice Pip. No, it can't, it's not a Mines Fish. It has to be mutant carp or stingray, but I've never seen a mutant carp that bad. I'm sure. I'm sure it's going crazy. Super cucumber is not any season. It's any season, any weather. I don't believe this, but I'll just submit it just because. I that was a very hard fish. Property eating e eating eating. Uh, I don't know what I want to say. Eating because update is 
Doesn't belong to me. Uh, I'm just gonna quit eating. Why is it not centering properly? Eating. I'll be back. Gulping mayo. Yeah, I'm gonna go check mayo real quick. I'll be back. Enjoy charity with headphones on. Jam into the music.
I was gonna be AFK longer chat, but then I was back reading the Stardew Valley Discord and CA said get ready like 15 minutes ago. <laughs> so I don't know what that means. <laughs> so now I'm kind of just like. Don't get too ready. He said get ready at 1.2. taking a while for steam or something I don't know Can you play Core Keeper while we wait? No, I'm kind of just... <laughs> uh... I really know what to do. I need a break from Gino Card. I was playing it for too long. Now I'm kind of just browsing Discord, but I don't really want to show... Discord. There's over a hundred people sitting in the fucking Cindersat Forest chat in the Stardew Valley Discord. And there's a bunch of- you have con- con- er, Concerned Nation Ape, Concerned Baller, Concerned Crater, Concerned Joseph, Concerned the Lesbian, Concerned Ale, <laughs> Concerned Apple Juice. <Jew. laughs> so many people's name is just fucking Concerned. To keep breaking the discord apparently the new farmer thing is in like a two minute chat cooldown But his name is Concerned for Ape. Fucking rats. Concerned apple juice gets me. Uh, I'm like, <laughs> I'm kind of just like, <laughs> I feel like everybody's in this state of limbo, kind of just like sitting here, like, when is it gonna come out? And it's just like, my life doesn't matter right now until the update queue shows up here. Like, my life doesn't matter. As soon as this says update queued, the life matters. And we're kind of just like... You know, just fucking dead. <laughs> Waiting. <laughs> we're 
We're just chilling, yeah. ZA said soon, but not too soon, like 20 minutes ago now. I feel like I'm waiting at an appointment. This is worse than waiting at an appointment. What does it say about me waiting for the update by watching Habu waiting for the update? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everybody is saying their hours on Stardew. <laughs> I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> be that guy. <laughs> Let me just take a, a snip of it. And send it. I don't want to be that guy, but... I'm that guy, apparently. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I close. I always close. like a minute cooldown. I was gonna type worst part is is I know people with more <laughs> much more <laughs> Can't type it hello who uh lead chat I'm pretty sure has more now I could be wrong with that and uh lack of tooth who was on Tushi's team for the for the Twitch rivals has like double this. Yeah. Where is he? Uh he's offline now. He's quit streaming, doing his own thing. He had like nearly 6k hours on the game when like the first Twitch Rivals came around. I don't review games. Would you recommend playing this game? Yes. I'm not gonna do a review. <laughs> Just not recommend it. Uh, I don't recommend the way that I play now. I guess maybe I do. I... 
You know, I thought it was just my chat being down bad about the mayo, but it's like everywhere. Like, wh why does the Stardew Valley community just latch onto like one thing and never let it go sometimes? It, like our new thing is mayo. We only care about mayo now. Everything is about fucking mayo. Because memes, I think that's being a human. It's it's wild. Why are we hating on Mayo? Mayo is controversial. <laughs> Apparently it is. We are overthinkers. Ape should have not posted that because it's the only thing I read about the updates now. What time does it drop? No one knows. Controversial topic. Butter or mayo on bread while making grade cheese? Uh, butter. Athos Child, Smappy Creator, Stardew Valley will release in approximately 45 minutes. Where'd you get that? Is that in the modding section? Okay, if you wanted a lot of spoilers about the new update, you just had to go to the making or the modding section of the update and then you kind of just find a lot of random spoilers with it. Bless Pathos. Forty-five minutes. We got forty-five minutes, chat. Do I like mayo? No. Uh, do not know. The patch notes were up on the wiki pretty quickly last time, if I remember correctly, because Pathos just already added it. There's already a, uh... I can show this. Uh... This has been out for like months, by the way. It is not anything new. Uh... How do I show this again? Modding. Guidelines. We got 45 minutes, I'm kind of fine. I 
Actually, it might be down because they might actually be editing the page right now, funny enough. Or does it say 45? Uh, Pathos said it in the modding general channel. On the official wiki. Or on the official Discord, not official wiki. My DMs with Tyler. I don't know. His link sent me to the same page. Let's change how to update your mod, sugar. What's your new item? Oh, here we go. It's at the bottom. Yeah, this has been on this page forever. If you go to the modding page, it's at the bottom. It tells you the 1.6 patch notes. Uh, I doubt it has everything. Yeah, no. It, these are just all the known bug fixes, game balances that is out already. That's in the beta build for mods that doesn't have any of the new content. But it's like, yeah, this is all public knowledge. Or if you did a little bit of searching, you could find this. This has been out for like months before the before the new year started. When was the DM with Tyler? Yeah. 316. Yeah, this has been out for almost a full fucking year. These patch notes. Has been out for almost a full fucking year. Uh, but yeah. I'm surprised they're not changing this yet. So me leaking the mushroom cave now provides a mushroom every second day was not actually a leak. It's right here. You just had to do a little bit of reading. And this is where a lot of my spoilers came from, by the way. This is really what I was saying. Added grace jumps. Apparently, they did make Juno McCart easier. I did not know this. How do you get there? Uh, literally, it's at the... If you type... Go to... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Go to the wiki, type in modding. Uh, type in modding. Uh, where is it? Is it creating mods? Where is it? How did I get there? I forget. Creating mods. Oh, yeah. Then, margin guidelines. Click on Stardew Valley 1.6. Literally right here. Smappy 1.4. Probably works the same. No, it doesn't. Bottom, 1.6. All the way at the bottom, see vanilla. Patch notes. Jukebox can be used on Ginger Island. This is like all stuff that we knew for a while. Farmhouse and Pet Bull can be moved. Increased shaving and Chapman effects on Giants crops. Mushroom Cave now provides mushroom every second day. Random. Randomization no longer produces simple repeating patterns in many cases except... IG clay farming, mushroom level prediction, crab pot, fish offset, etc. You can enable legacy random randomization in the advanced options. Running weeds no longer destroys artifacts hot. Still till dirt on the island farm now decays in the same way the regular farm. Improvements. Yada yada yada. A lot of these are just bug fixes. They don't work great.
E. Uh, E. Sorry, Valley Discord, Pathos Child, one of the developer or one of the developers and the creator of Smappy said 45 minutes. So it should come out uh at about 130, I believe. Is what they're aiming for. 130. Yeah, the tail dirt was uh what I asked for. This is basically like I have been leaking this stuff for like ages. This is the, the stuff that I've been commenting on for ages, by the way. It's just this, which is literally anybody can find this. Holding tea sapling or a seed over garden pot now shows the placement. Fix potted tea bushes planted in town not being harvestable. Fix bee houses, generic honey. Yeah. Oh, it's still on here. Many improvements for multiplayer performance and stability that include Steam players now now use Steam multiplayer authentication, potentially improving connection issues significantly. Large multi or multiplayer packets are now compressed, reducing bandwidth. Internal optimization and data syncing. This is like the juice. This is the juice for multiplayer speedrunning. There's a lot of netcode improvements happened very recently, the past few weeks. Yeah, I mean, they've been doing a lot of shit. This is the juice right here. Mayo juice? Fuck off with the mayo! <laughs> you play a perfection speedrun? That sounds awful, but we'll see. Revalance crop fairy event, the chance no longer depending on the number of, cro of planted crops. It can no longer happen on the last day of the season to avoid. Oh, we don't lose the random time growth anymore. Shaving is better. NPCs now shove chests out of their way instead of destroying them. That's nice. How many minutes do we have left? Like... 40-ish, probably. 40, 40, 40. I think their goal time is 130, but I could be wrong at this point. Wait, I just want to see how bad the Stardew Discord has gotten. No, they're not losing their mind as much as I was hoping. It's like 40 minutes from now. The next 30 minutes. <sighs> what is... Else? Do you have to have a specific modding tag? Be able to see the modding thing? No, you shouldn't. Uh. 
This cord really is in shambles. Okay, maybe it's closer to the 15 minute mark. Stardew Valley 1.6.0 will release in approximately 40 minutes by Concerned Pathos. Today at 12.38. So probably the 12.15 to 12.30 range is their goal. Tweet <laughs> CA tweeted making coffee based. Making coffee. <laughs> Giga Chad. Thirty seconds, two hundred and fifty commons. Wait, I gotta see that now. Oh, I always forget how to do this. Number one gaming trending, Stardew Valley. <laughs> oh my god, it's about to go down. Alright, before I scroll down, how many people are gonna ask about the mobile update? Any bets? How long will this take to get on mobile? How long will this take to get on consoles? Please hurry, I want to play. Four hours is fine, I'm still at work. Thank you, King. Uh, blue chicken. Oh, we're not seeing any! You deserve it. Good morning. Finally. He has arisen. Oh, this is more wholesome than I thought it would be. That's more wholesome than I thought it would be. I'll, I'll look at it later. Is there anything else? Wait, who want who wants the bet? Th this is this would be a classic CA thing to do. Reading this line, you can no longer lose golden scythe, infinity weapons, or tools when knocked unconscious. Who wants to bet he forgot to add the iridium scythe to this, and somebody's gonna lose the iridium scythe day one on accident? <laughs> <laughs> There's a radium site that was leaked a while ago on a CA tweet. Uh, uh, no it's literally a just post him saying iridium scythe, no? Yeah. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> Iridium Scythe. That's all he said. Giga Chad. Also, oh, this is an iconic tweet. This tweet is iconic. There's going to be a Stardew 1.6 update. It's mostly changes for modders, which will make things easier and more powerful to mod, but there's also a new... Also, new game content. I'll be at much less than 1.5. I'm taking a break from Haunted Chocolate here to work on this in the moment. <laughs> Modding update, by the way. Iconic tweet. Iconic. And then he posts this later. A new major festival. Two mini festivals. New late game content, which expands on each of the skilled areas new items and crafting recipes alternative jo or jojo alternative some of the end game quests 100 plus new lines of dialogue winter outfits new type of reward for completing billboard requests four player uh, or eight player multiplayer many small additions and adjustments new farm type new secrets and more small update by the way modding update by the way 11 months later. It's just a modding update. It's it's just a modding update, guys. Nice and small. Wild horseradish juice. Big pump. A big key fruit. I forgot all of these. Big chest. Merry Christmas and happy feast of the winter star. Uh, 1.6 ended up being larger in scope than originally planned. I am done adding new major content to it now. 
aiming. Uh, so this is something Piano pointed out, and I just have to point it out because it's going to piss a lot of people off. Did anybody notice that every single tweet he did of the spoilers was a different font and, like, a different background? And just different, like, color. Like, you have this one. Fix the bug. Normal text. This one's slightly different. Different shading. A little bit of, uh, different coloring. And then he got a little fancy with this one and added some dogs and cats. And it's just another color. And then he, he did this. <laughs> Each page note was different. <laughs> like he was doing these all fancies. Fancy and then he did this. A bright white background. You can now drink mayonnaise. You can fucking drink mayonnaise. This is not a statement. This is a threat. This is a threat. 100% a threat. And then he made this one nice and pretty. Picture. It's a promise. It's a fucking threat. As a professional graphic designer that kills me, that is such a CA thing to do. It's iconic. Not my CA. Not my CA reply to remind him to drink his mayo. Getting 55 likes and there are 75 likes in two minutes. It's a. It's not a promise. Not a threat. Obligatory or obituary to sanity. Yeah. And probably grinds his own beans too for his fancy coffee. Yeah, the Tushi Classic. This is so funny. I can see. Oh, I like this post. This is so funny. I can see A drinking his coffee, enjoying the chaos he caused. True. Do we have an official announcement? Oh, yeah. No, it is. Even in, on the bulletin board, it says Stardew Valley 1.6 will release in 45 minutes at uh, 2.47. So they're aiming for 12.15. So we got we got like 12 minutes, chat. We got 12 minutes. 12 minutes, ladies and gentlemen. 12 minutes. I'm curious how the... How does the... Oh, I don't want to go to channel. Well, I guess I can go to... That's fine. How does this look? Yeah. Oh, the... yeah, I figured. I figured we had some... Uh, I don't want to hear myself. I figured we had some very high viewer viewership here. 22,000 viewers. God damn. That's the most I have ever seen in this channel besides, like, a, a few instances. Everybody is fucking waiting. Everybody is waiting. 20k 20k waiting room honestly god damn just fighting words <laughs> yeah, what is piano's title new update and new quests to complete oh, wait what is this full title New update and new quest to complete the community center faster than anybody else in the world. The classic. Look at doing opium strat. Uh, we got twelve. No, no, no. I was wrong. Uh, let me. 
the official announcement on the bulletin board of the official Stardew Valley server. Stardew Valley 1.6.0 will be released in approximately 45 minutes. This was posted at 12.47 p.m. my time. That is 1.15, a.k.a. 10 minutes from now. And as such, I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> One last time before we get into this. All right, we're going to go back to, uh, waiting for update. 1.6. 23 minutes. How am I? Am I stupid? Can I not do math? Why can I not do math? Chat. Yeah, it's longer than 10 minutes. You are right. Chat, I can't do math. Somebody please help my sanity. I was right the first time I did math, and then it felt wrong, and then it felt right, and then it felt wrong. Chat. Chat. I got mayo on my brain. I got mayo on my brain right now. Show us Steam library. I don't know. I don't know. That's a bunch of random shit. I, I don't know what you expect. I got 3.4k hours in Terraria. <laughs> <laughs> missing one achievement. <laughs> what achievement am I missing? Black Mirror, obtain the cell phone. Yeah, that makes sense. Stupid achievement. This is gonna... <laughs> this is going to... Well, of course. I mean, I plan to stream a stupid amount of hours today, so. Tough one, two, run one. It's terrible if I'm not doing glitches. Uh, so we can sit here and wait patiently for 20 minutes or we can figure out something else to do. Wordle. Wordle. I think I did the mini today already, so I can't do the mini. Is it gonna... I'm, gonna... I'm gonna be so bad at this because I'm probably just gonna end up looking at chat and chat's just gonna tell me random shit. 
Uh, but where do I want to open with? Can I do mayos? Oh, I can. <laughs> uh, Alright, we have an A. What word do we want to do with A? an E and an A, and I don't know the location of either of them. <laughs> I looked at chat, and I like beans too much not to do it. How do I have- I have no idea where anything is! It starts or ends with an A? Doesn't start with a B. I'm trying my best not to look at chat, but it's like I'm so used to it. I'm really bad at word games, by the way. For those who have never seen me think a sub on this channel, you know I suck at pronouncing shit. It goes the same way with words. English might be my first language, but I am ass at it. Uh, words do not just come to me. I think it ends with a B. You know, by normal rules, I would never guess beans because I don't like the guess letters that I've already guessed. But I thought I saw beans and my brain was like, that's funny. I'm going to type in beans. Doesn't start with a B? It starts with an A or an E. I guess it doesn't have to start with an A. It can't be bears, chat. It literally can't be bears. Yeah, I'm already I'm looking at chat again because I don't want it I don't want this to take forever. Here, here's my here's my brain concept. This is why I don't do puzzles like this on stream chat. Because my brain takes forever to think of words, and then I start doing something else, and I'll think of a word that Ashley thinks about it, like, five to ten minutes later. I can't just, like, sit here and just think and stare at these words and be like, beans. And now my brain's like, I gotta look at chat. Because I don't want this to take forever, and I'm just cheating at this point. Because you guys are saying words that I would never think of. Like, label? I never would have thought of that. That Abide? Never. Those do not go. Th those do not go in my, like... That is not in my vocabulary. Label doesn't even work. Yeah, that is true. The best guess is like abide. It's probably abide is like the worst part. Cable also works. <laughs> but it's like I would never think of these things. I'm doing abide just because everybody's saying it and it's probably the answer. And like it I would never have gotten this. And that's like the thing. I just would never have gotten that. W words are just not my thing. Let us play. See, this is why I play Preferdal, because I can actually do something about it. Random fish. Like, I actually know things, and I can think about it and do it quickly. Like, that was a nice, easy fish. That felt like either a sunfish or a smallmouth. I'm going to go sunfish. Uh, and so that means it's any weather. Uh, I don't... Uh, I don't think sunfish... Smallmouth anytime. It was like an easy fish. It's not river, so it can't be smallmouth. 
that means it's probably ocean. It's probably an easier ocean fish. Uh, it does share time in spring. I think herring's also spring. So herring's probably a safe bet. Uh, it's not herring, but it's same time frame as that. Um, and it is an ocean only fish. What else do we have in ocean only? It's probably just anchovy, right? Because it's same time. It's probably just anchovy. Yeah. It's like these go much faster. Uh, I feel like this is a little bit of a bait. It's not one of those like normal fish. I'm going to guess small mouth or large mouth that gives me the most info right off the bat. So it's not any season. It goes slightly higher. Uh, it could have just been a bait salmon. Let's just go salmon next. Not river. It's not river or lake, so it's probably closer to ocean. I mean, it could also be... Uh... Why do I feel like it's one of the night market fish? It's not... Uh, yeah, it's like ocean. It, it, that just didn't feel like an ocean pattern. It wasn't red mullet. It, I guess it could have been tilapia or snapper, but it can't be snapper because it's any weather. So it would have to be tilapia, but it didn't feel like a normal tilapia. It's not fall as well, and tilapia is fall. I feel like it's a night market fish. I just don't know which one. Is it midnight squid? Yeah. It had to be midnight squid. There's just no, no way else. I always forget which one's the dart and which one's not the dart. Uh, that one was a little weird. I'm gonna random guess walleye. Uh, is walleye just fall? I think walleye's just fall. It's a fall. Is it really a fall only fish? Never remember. What other fall only fish do we have? Not out, but Steam has been updated. I didn't get the update. We're waiting for that to show that it's updating. There was an announcement in the official Discord about the release time. I'm gonna beat you first to 1.6 CC gaming. Probably, I'm not trying to do it fast. Ne necessarily. Uh, what is it? Uh, it's not river. It's any weather, it's fall only. What is a fall only fish? Fall or winter? Oh, oh, that makes things easier. Oh, it's just, it's just 
No, it's not. Uh, yeah, it's fall winter. What's a fish is fucking fall winter? It's like that's all I should need. No, 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 no. Winter only. No, 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 no. No, that's summer as well. No. I think super cucumber is. These are fall winter, I think. Tiger trout. It's not river. It's not river or lake. It has to be ocean. I'm looking at ocean fish. I think it's one of these two. So I'll just check the rest. Did not feel like you, but it could have been a weird one. Albacores also. It has a weird time. It's not in the evening, though. It's not in the evening, so I don't think it can be super cucumber, but it, I, I think it's albacore. No, it has a different time. What? It's more than just... It, it can't be, though. It was. Wow, okay. I thought it wasn't. Okay, that's weird. Uh... They're gonna throw catfish in there. Any weather, uh, I mean, it felt too fast to be like the tuna or eel, so it's like I want to throw in sturgeon guesses, but I feel like they're just wrong at the same time. It went like too high, like, I like it can't be eel anymore, but it's like it could be tuna, but I kind of doubt it. It is ocean, it's ocean. It has to either be summer or f winter only. It has to be summer or winter only. Because catfish means it's not... No, it has to be... Yeah, no. I don't think it counts the summer from the Secret Woods, by the way. So, this is uh, spring, fall, gone. And then... So it has to be summer or winter because this isn't like perfect. So it has to be either a summer or winter fish. And it's a It's not squid because it's too late. It technically overlaps a little with super. Oh no, but super is not that. So and it's ocean. I think the only like winter time fish that are, are that can do this is Is squid? No, no, but squid doesn't overlap with it. I feel like a squid though. I don't think it can be summer. Wait, I guess it it can be summer. It did not feel like a puffer fish, but people keep saying, "Yeah, it's a winter fish. It's winter." It's winter. It has to be a winter only fish. I think it's. Is it just a blobfish? No, it's not night market. It's too late. What? What? That's not a squid. That did not feel like a squid. This is an easy fish. You just you just take a random shot in the dark and just say. S okay, I didn't mean to click puffer, but that's fine. It is beach. There is a uh, ocean though. It's part summer. Uh, like all day, kind of just at the bottom. Kind of just 
is like a nobody fish, you know. Probably just like sardine. Anchovy. Herring. <laughs> just guess all these all these fish. Tilapia. I'm gonna lose this just because I'm I'm going insane now. Yeah, no. What was it? Flounder. Not guessing that. We have we're we're done with that. I'm more focused on uh We have five minutes, chat. It's out. Uh, update cute. I do not have update. Restart Steam. Little Simsy just started playing Stardew Valley. I, I, I wonder what that could mean. Ah, oh, shit, wait, I fully signed out. Fuck! Oh no, I fully signed out. Uh, I gotta sign it with a fucking QR code. Wait, wait, no, that's not how this works. Wait, what is my Steam login? Ah, oh, shit. Uh, you're not allowed to see this. No, I'm screwing up. Update queued, it's killing! We're in the game! We're good. We're gaming. We're in, boys. We are in. Developed by Concerned Ape. Is there? Well, somebody will find the new Easter egg later. I'm done with this. If you don't want any spoilers, see yourself. I hate the look of this. If you don't want any spoilers, see yourself out now. I appreciate you guys lurking and just hanging out at the start, but uh, this is where a bunch of spoilers are going to be said and done. That is the unfortunate reality here. Uh, but yes, welcome to 1.6. If you want spoilers, welcome in. I am, I gotta change all my titles. 1.6 Perfection Speedrun. That is that for Twitch. And for YouTube. Typing in the wrong thing. Live 1.6 perfection speed or unsafe. All right. We are here, ladies and gentlemen. It has been almost three years since the last major update. And CA has done everything in his power to give us this. We are going to be doing everything on the new stuff so we got the meadows lands farm you start with a coop and two chickens we're gonna go hobs as usual perfection and 1.6 is our favorite thing we're gonna oh. he wait he added new cats
Wait a minute. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'm gonna do a dog. I'm more of a dog person. Which one do I like? I kind of like the bandana, not gonna lie. I do like the bandana. Bless. This is a very small speedrunner thing that a lot of people don't know about. But prior to the 1.6 update, if you click the randomize button, it used to not include any of the new shirts, hairstyles, or accessories of 1.5. But I see new hairstyles already when I'm randomizing. So we're going to have more characters when we randomize for this. Bless. I like this one. And then this is another thing for me. Let's just go through the tab. We are doing Remix. I don't care about CC. Always Remix. Monster spawning on the farm. Doesn't matter. Not going to do not. Starting cabins. <laughs> Seven. None. Yeah. Cabin layout. Uh, Whatever. Use a legacy. Make random choices in the way that often repeats patterns. Most players should keep this disabled. We're going to keep that disabled. This is the clay farming thing that I mentioned, by the way. Do we want intro? Are we going to? We're going to do the intro, aren't we? We got to do the intro. I kind of just want to get right into this. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. <laughs> uh, yeah. I just want I just want to get into this. We'll, we'll do intro. We'll do intro. Timer. I'll just start the timer. Is the grandpa bed fixed? All right, chat. Here's what we'll do. We'll watch it until we see the grandpa bed. If the grandpa bed isn't fixed, I'm skipping the intro. Deal? Deal. Don't skip it. Oh, you're right. I'm going to have to turn off the music. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. I'm so used to playing music. I want to see. I want to be able to hear the new music. I'm going to do that. Uh. Oh, we're not going to hear audio. Actually, we might hear audio. We'll be fine. I need to do. Uh. No, there we go. I have my scenes. You need to unmute game. No, this is the title screen thing. I would have to mute. I would have to load up a farm and unmute the game. It's fine. All right, let's get into this. I'm done stalling. The bed's not fixed. Bed's not fixed. No one cares. Bed's not fixed. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this is pretty. Look at this. A little bit in the way for optimization, but that's fine. We start with, where's my parsnips? All right, Chad, I'm going to leak something to you. Uh, what is it? There we go. You can do this now. <laughs> you can just drop stuff out of your hot bar. <laughs> Shift right click. All right. Farm. Little rundown, it looks like. Zoom out so we can see more. Little rundown. Here's our coop. Oh, this is like the shiny grass. Yo, this is... <laughs> It's so lovely. Screenshot. Now I'll run around. It's easier. Ooh, got to turn on animation canceling. Give me a second. Playing the entire day without animation canceling. Timer. Okay. Who fucking cares? It's not an official run. Oh, this is a pretty river. I'll, I'll look at the animals in a minute. I want to run around real quick. First day is getting our bearings. A new adventure. Uh, oh, wow. That's a lot of tabs. Wait, let me... I got to turn on music. We'll look at that later. There's Grandpa's shrine back there. Yeah, not a lot of farming space. It's very... Interesting. I guess there's more farming space than I thought. It's like sporadic though. It's like weird farming space. 
Where's the cave? That's a good question. I didn't see the cave. There's a warp totem over there. Oh, you can just walk up here. This tree is in a very inconvenient spot. Where is the cave? What's the chicken's name? What is it? Chip and Dip. <laughs> That's such a CA naming scheme. Chip and Dip. I wonder if it's random. <laughs> yeah, where is the cave? the cave at Wait, how do you even get to the grandpa area over there animation canceling still works great Wait, how do you get over to grandpa's shrine and the coop we can get a bridge i don't see the bridge Behind the cave? Yeah, I would assume the cave is, like, back there. I just don't know how to get to it. <laughs> I'm gonna waste so much time trying to get to it <laughs> today. Is there, like, uh... There's so much more debris on this farm now. Is there, like, a pathway here? Maybe the... Does the coop spawn in front of it? That would be so troll if the coop spawns in front of it. I'll remove the pin message. Yeah, this farm looks nice. Alright, now that I've wasted, like, basically all my day running around. Alright, I forgot he fixed this area. Now that you're fully zoomed out, you can see more. Oh, that's so cool. And it's like, you still go away at the trees. Oh, that's so nice. All right, Pierre, what do you got for me? Uh, that's new. That's a new rug. That's new, right? That's a new rug. Dehydrator. 10,000 fire cores. Place five pieces of fruit or edible mushrooms inside to dry them. Huh. Um. I mean, we're just gonna buy potatoes. I'm just gonna run around town to see what I see changed. Okay, this is the most casual you'll see me play, chat. We're speed running. All right. Uh, I probably should have kept that mixed seed. But I still want to explore the patch because I haven't really played it. Uh, beach doesn't look any different. Did I check calendar yet? Yeah, let me go check calendar. Did the patch notes come out? Can I just start talking about shit now? I guess I can. Uh, bookseller. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Bookseller on the 21st. Notes are out? Okay. There's a bunch of things. Alright. Let me go do the one thing that I am going to basically be prioritizing in this playthrough. <laughs> uh, we gotta go to Cinder Sap. Uh, alright. Also, let me clarify what I'm doing here. So... In the new update, there is ways to just buy perfection. I think it's like 20, 25 million gold total. You can just outright buy perfection for an X number of money. We're not doing that. We're skipping that. That's lame. That will be the speed run for later. That's lame. 
We're doing everything as intended, but this is what I'm talking about. Only a master of the five ways may enter. We gotta get level we gotta get level 10 in every scale ASAP. ASAP. Level 10 in every scale. That's what we're doing. That's our only goal. That's our goal. Oh, so I need to check out this powers. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Okay. So this is the new wallet. Instead of having a wallet, you have the powers tab now. That's what this is. Oh, and you can also see your animals and your friendship from this menu. That's cool. Collectibles. What new items do we have? Oh, we got a lot of new items. Why is there a fish here? Wait, what's the new fish? Oh, there's a lot of new fish. Oh, there's a lot. This used to be one page. No new artifacts. No new minerals. Uh, one, two, three, four, five new cooking recipes. Not that bad. Huh. That's a new menu. Does it look like any new NPCs right away? I love how there's cherry trees on the map now. All right, cool. Let's get started then. This is way too much to take in. I hope chat is uh, taking in this as well as I am because uh, <laughs> I'm a little overwhelmed myself. There's a big tree. Wait, where's the big tree? Yeah, yeah. That, oh, yeah. You meant uh, in the skills tree? Where's the skills tree? Yeah, there's a big tree right here. I'm kind of like experiencing everything. Okay, I am... I feel like not having the parsnips at the start of this map kind of messes with a lot of farming XP, but at the same time, you should be able to make back the farming XP very fast from the ch chickens. They should just be more energy. I like the starting plot right here, by the way. It's kind of cute. Energy. Oh, of course, that exhausted me. Oh, well, we don't need energy anyways. We're fine. This is the new farm. I'll deal with things tomorrow. I need a chest. Let's start our lovely text sign. I'm not crafting that. That's a waste. I love how we only start with, like, 15 hay. I also love how I didn't let the animals out yesterday. Journal streamer. Harvest an egg from your chickens. Greet 20 people. Okay. I guess that makes sense. I hate how you have to, like, manually chop the weeds in here. Otherwise, you'll get rid of your blue grass. Do they prioritize the blue grass? It doesn't look like it. That's kind of annoying. I wonder how that uh, functions. It kind of sucks if they don't prioritize the, the blue grass because it, it, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to give them more friendship from it now. That would kind of blow. I hate not having magnetism. Can I look at the NPC menu again? No one's really going to be changed. I guess the wizard shows up earlier.
All right, we're gonna have to kick this into overdrive soon because I feel like I'm just gonna start dilly dallying here. I should probably read the mail and go fishing. If I said my goal is, oh, I guess we'll do it tomorrow since I exhausted myself and I'm fine doing it on a rain day. Or I guess I can just eat the fish. Well, thank you for the raid. Yeah, same. Oh, you don't have an email. 1.6 is officially live. It is out on uh, Steam. Only platform. I did everything remixed. Yeah, there's a text sign now. Uh, I'm skipping cutscenes because I don't care. Well, chat, here's the thing. We need... Is this even worth it? This is probably not worth it. I'm kind of trolling. <laughs> My brain is telling me, get fishing level... Uh, get fishing level uh, 10 as soon as possible. But realistically, I just need to get fishing level 3. And then... Uh, and then we can stop fishing. Because I just need to be able to buy crab pots. And then we're just going to focus on getting as much money as possible. That's our goal. We need a fish chat. We need to get crab pots to crab pots, fam. And then we need to get money. Got a fish. I'm going to play my own music because... I don't want to sit here in silence because the music's not playing. Music didn't even start. Oh, great. I closed Spotify, so I can't even open up the music. Why did I have to close Spotify? Oh, no. There we go. There's something? Yeah, I did see that. I just don't know what it... Well, <laughs> I know what it is, but... I'll act like I don't know what it is. I think I really should just end up ignoring a lot of fishing here. I'm kind of just like in the casual mindset where I want to fish. But I don't. Uh, I can't reach that. I need max skills. <laughs> this is definitely not the efficient way of doing it. Because I'm pretty sure there's better ways of leveling up skills with... Uh, I think these new books that he added. I think there's these experience books now. We might get to see one that are just like really good early game. I'm wasting my energy because I keep thinking my follower alert is a ring. I really shouldn't be doing this. My mind is so mixed right now. I want to speed run to like get to the end game content. But my mind also kind of just wants to be a little chill and slow about it. But fishing is so fucking slow.
All right, chat. The other thing that I want you guys to keep out an eye for is he added a lot of rare variants to uh, ambient critters. So it's like you'll you'll randomly see like rare colored butterflies and animals around Pelican Town now. Which I think is super cool. Yeah, quick out get. Two different names. Oh, that's kind of funny. All right, uh, chat. Spoiler for tea saplings. They were cut in half. They sell for two fifty. There's your spoiler. There's your there's your patch note spoiler. That said, the green tea now gives you a 0.5 move speed buff, so it's half that of coffee. And I think they changed a few of the prices of it, so it's better to sell the leaves. Yeah, 0.5 move speed buff, not one. Yes, that's one of the street names. You know, these bubbles are just like... Like, <laughs> I'm staying until these bubbles are gone, by the way. That's what I'm doing at this point. These bubbles are going to get me level 2 fishing, and then we're just going to peace. Yeah. He added the JoJo variant of perfection where you can just buy everything for perfection, essentially. And we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that yet. No, no, no. We, we have integrity. What's the point of buying perfection? Uh... Uh, people want to. Judge her out? Yeah. Oh, well, now I'll be doing the... Re I'm doing the remix CC this run, so we're kind of playing casual. Again, I'm just getting level 2 fishing here right now because I want to get level 10 in every skill to unlock that cave. Because that cave has some very obscenely broken items in it. Obscenely broken. How much JoJo is perfection? It's like over 20 mil, I think. Nine more achievements. In-game achievements or Steam achievements? I didn't see the Steam achievements get updated. Wow, nine more Steam achievements. I level two fishing up. Yeah. Uh, all right, we're good. I'm gonna sell all these though. Fish smoker. Oh yeah, this is what. Uh, by the way, if you are asking what the fish symbol thing was it's a smoker you can smoke fish now place fish inside with a piece of coal and create smoked fish which is worth double the quality of the fish is preserved sardine bait increase your chances to catch sardines oh yeah there's individual bait as well now forgot about that it's a nice change double yeah but it's a piece of coal as well so it's not as good as you think i don't know how long it takes More use for coal, though. Yeah, you need even more coal. 
My cat gave me a fish. What? Cats can give stuff now? That's kind of cool. Oh my god, poor 999 stack guy. <laughs> True. Rip Algo 07. Works on legendary fish? We'll find out. Uh, I assume that there's a way to get a bait for each fish but the legendaries. All right, we're going to speed things up now. We're going to go to the fifth. Uh, go. There's something behind Joja. There might be. I don't know. Both my animals are on the same spot. We got eggs. Free eggs for the mines. Uh, let me chop down trees. I'm going to need to clear out. I don't know what butterflies are rare variants, literally because I don't pay attention to them normally. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, we're really speedrunning here, chat. Look at this pace that we're on. We're on a real pacer. We would be in, uh... We'd probably be in summer by now. Normally. Absolute pace. I will say the sucky part about this farm... Not giving, uh, yeah, new farm type. The The main sucky part about this farm is not having the 15 parsnips for the first mines day. I don't need music again now that it's not raining. Got 100 extra G there. It's definitely an interesting farm layout. All right. Yeah, the fence is probably removable. Good luck day. Please let me go to the mines. I'll take it. I don't I don't know what that question mark is. I'll just take it. It's fine. I'm going to get bad luck if I go tomorrow, so it's kind of just like one of those things where you just fucking, you just accept it. We take the eggs as free food. Does your cola give speed buff? Yes. Yeah, it's a, it's a small modding update, by the way. It's a small modding update and not a large patch whatsoever, as you can see by the patch notes. We'll get those leaks tomorrow. I'll get the leaks tomorrow. I'm not going to go that deep today. It's bad luck day. All right, in the mines we go. So wait, I don't know if these barrels are more random than normal, but I guess since I didn't do remix mines, I should actually be able to get interesting ladders today. I wonder how broken. Uh... It makes some of these floors. I'm gonna have to get used to that. Like, normally speaking, breaking some of these diagonal rocks. Like, if I break that rock, normally, I wouldn't want to break, uh, 
the rock that's like two down one to the right <gasps> wait i forgot i remember this change he fixed the barrels on this floor chat i forgot he finally did it it only took six major patches glow ring it only took six major patches but he did it <laughs> oh Uh, I want Navy Tuxedo. Now we just gotta look a little dapper. Don't mind if I do. I want to know what the drop rate of that is because if it's high, it's actually gonna be really annoying inventory wise to be getting those constantly. Also, is it just me or is this a lot of enemies? It doesn't seem to be that high, at the very least. Uh, he doesn't, he doesn't even put everything in the patch notes. He is the type of guy when if there's a secret he's added to the game and doesn't want people to know from the patch notes, he'll just say secrets have been added. So the patch notes won't have everything. Our goal is to just get as deep into the mines as possible. Ideally get to the ice floors and then like upgrade my pickaxe and then go from there. You got some new ideas to sleep on. Does that just mean I've leveled up? Yeah. That's kind of cute. I guess that's a good way of saying that you've leveled up. It's so weird now that it's like proper to kind of just break rocks right at the start for the ladder YOLO. But it's also kind of annoying because if there's a freebie on the floor, you're a little screwed. Like, I still want to path in, like, the normal directions that I path in, even though it, like, doesn't necessarily fully make sense anymore. You know. Lovely. Lunar, thank you for the prime. Uh, rip that. Ooh. Looks like monster floors aren't totally random still. Crates are definitely random now. Rip the floor 24 club. Because that would have been a magnet ring. If the crates weren't if the crates uh weren't randomized. That kinda sucks. I got an early crab. I should have dropped some stuff off before I came here, but it's fine. I'll go five more after this. Crabs. Should be running community center. No, CA will not add an elevator into Skull Caverns. That is the most cheap mod of cheap mods. It's supposed to be a challenge, guys. I'm pretty sure he added a permanent shrine for hard mode uh, Skull Caverns, though. I remember reading that. Phone zone broken? No, I gotta manually do it. I'm gonna go up first. <gasps> we got a femur, nice. Good upgrade. Only sucky part is, is that I've already gone through two monster floors already. 
<laughs> so, uh, that femur would have been nice the previous two monster floors. Go Goblin. Frogmaster, thank you for the prime. Baby Toss now has a chance to crit. I'm pretty sure that's a weapon. There's also now a Terraria reference in the game. One of the swords was added to the game. I'm not getting much copper. That blows. Because I want to get a pickaxe ASAP. Mines are remixed, Jess. Yeah, I mentioned this earlier, but some of the new crafting recipes are ridiculous in the power room. Like, when I say ridiculous, I mean like 99 bars each ridiculous. I'm sorry, what? 99 iron bars for a single item, yes. I'm gonna pick these up on the way home. Do you buy chickens? No, I think I'm I'm going to sell the chickens as soon as I think they're a high enough value to sell. <laughs> they're kind of worthless. But they're chip and dip, so. Not gonna roast them yet. Alright, now it's a decent day. Combat, bug steak, cherry bomb, nice. Good luck. Alright. Deserved. Yo, where's the wall? <laughs> wow. Wait. Holy. I didn't realize how far away the water source on this map is. Oh, that's pretty bad. I don't need the watering can. Make a well. The one map where a well might be useful on. How can you cook with an uh, up-degraded house now? Uh, you can cook because cookout kicks are like forging level 3 now, I think. What's the main, uh, you start with a coop and chickens. That is, and, uh, there's something called blue grass, which the animals like a lot more. I didn't pick up the eggs. Um. We'll see how much use it actually gets. I don't think it'll get much use in speedrunning because that is not a very good uh, trade off. We don't really like coops, they're kind of slow and don't really do much. Animals aren't very good at this game, in this game, so it's like one of those things where it's like it's a cool concept and it's nice and it could technically be a nod to like Shawnee in some ways. Because it's like, you know, he did that entire series where, uh... Or not series. He did the video where he was trying to get the coop in the first day. But, uh, yeah, it's 
not very good now. I haven't looked at the new achievements. There's so much in the update, it's hard to, like, look at everything. Like, I technically have looked at the notes before the patch, but it's, it's like, I still have not played it. I've just seen the notes. So it's kind of one of those things where it's like, people who are reading the notes right now have just as much info as I do, for the most part. Except for, like, some technical details, but... I also hate how the slimes AI still do that. Super annoying. Uh, right click and spam left click. I have gotten three Dwarf Scroll 1s already. Game. Chill. A hill. Oh, that's weird how that works. Also, nice club. It didn't actually open up the next menu. It normally does. That's really weird. Only a master. That is what we're trying to do because there are some downright broken items in there. <laughs> Iridium scythe. Uh, that I kind of want. Fuck. Fuck. Bait and Baba. Read this to gain some fishing XP. You've learned a few things about fishing. Did I get any... I think those give you XP. I don't know how much. That's what the bookseller does. <laughs> I think. What days was the bookseller? I have to relook at the calendar. That was a cute animation, by the way. Dwarf Scroll 4. That's good. We're doing great on Dwarf Scrolls. Some of these barrels are kind of, like, actually worth going for now. Because they're random. The third Sunday. Thank you. I don't know what this floor is going to have. First. I need to see how expensive they are, and I don't know how much XP they give. And that's more of the concerning part. I'd like to know how much XP they give. I think it's 100? Wow, these barrels were trash. Wow! Those barrels are really bad for mine speedrunning now. You're so used to getting like eight cave carrots from that. And I got zero. Wait, that's actually really bad for speedrunning. No, it's a best luck day. Best luck. I don't think best luck will have an effect on drops of crates. I is still assume it's just an odds chance, but I could be wrong. You never know. Uh, are you ready for some new money runs? No, I'm not going to do money runs anymore. But the heavy furnaces are interesting. Uh, new furnaces take, uh, they basically have like a 50% chance of producing an extra bar or some shit when you smelt. I don't know how you get the recipe, but I'm going to go out of my way for money here. Is luck is how many barrels? Yes, luck determines how many barrels there can be or affects how many barrels they can be. But there was a lot of barrels there, but I just got nothing from them. I'm used to getting, like, a few topazes and amethyst from those barrels, along with, uh... Um... With a bunch of cave carrots, but I just didn't get any cave carrots from it, because RNG was changed. It's kind of interesting. Nah, the Meadowlands farm is kind of like... 
from what I am looking at for how we want to do CC routes, the metal la the meto lands farm is kind of doo-doo. I think it's a very pretty farm and is very interesting in some potential challenge runs. But it's a pretty bad farm in terms of speedrunning. It would specifically need a niche that would fulfill needing a coop ASAP. And I don't think there's any speedrun that needs that. And that's more of the issue. No speedrun needs a coop early. Well, at least I have a, uh... A glow ring. I do feel like I'm getting more, uh... Geodes, because it's random. Okay, to be fair, he called it small originally, and then he made a tweet later saying that the scope of the update definitely got bigger. So, I'm kind of making... Carrots! There's carrots in the game now? Carrots! He made it a reality! There's carrots! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking carrots! Three days. A bad of a cre- it's gotta be worse than parsnips, no? I'm gonna grow one and just keep it and not sell it until uh, later, by the way. Because I want a seed maker for it in case if I need it for whatever reason. Uh, we're probably gonna go to 35 here and pass out. We got another carrot seed. Apparently they're dropping here, which is interesting. I wonder if they have a higher rate. Ace. Energy I have. This one. What else do I want to bring home? I'm kind of content with this. Before carrot cake, there might. Bad thing for the prime. We gotta plant the. We gotta plant the carrot seeds. Pickled carrots. I mean, this is just my way of playing casually. To be fair. I wouldn't necessarily say I'm going for a world record, but... Yes. I need to eat cave carrot because I want to plant these. You, you, no. one, two. Interesting sprite. Oh, I love how they added this. This is new, right? Wait, what was that last one? Uh, how do you see me? Build a well. Oh, okay. Robin's trying to sell you a well. Oh, they're asleep. We should probably feed. Now they fed themselves. We're good. Just need the copper for the... 
for the pickaxe upgrade here. Not like a bad. I level two is nice. Oh, we gotta do Queen of Sauce. Bad luck. Uh, that's kind of fine. I'm just gonna go five floors and then farm uh, iron for the most part. Iron and copper. <laughs> Just need to go five levels. Shouldn't be that bad. We got to focus a lot in the mines because we want to get sprinklers up and we want to get uh, our crops going. I'm trying to save up quite a bit of money for the... For at least strawberries. I'm going to check out the bookseller, but I don't think I'm going to buy anything from her. Because if if it costs money to buy the stuff, I really care about having early game money to uh, pilot in. Also, this is new terrain, by the way. Anybody notice this? Like, he, he's readjusted the, the sprites to make them less uh, repeating. This is more jagged than normal. Normally, it was just the same tile set, like, repeating three times, but now it's, uh, that's definitely, uh, less repeaty. Any particular changes? Uh, you can do this. You can just drop stuff from your inventory without having to worry about it. A very interesting speedrunning change. Uh, the modders had a... Uh, yes, modders... Didn't have access to the new stuff of 1.6 but they had the infrastructure that the update was supposed to be which was the modding update so they had the modding infrastructure uh patches so they could update uh to that but they had no idea what the new content was that was on a separate patch is how that worked uh, this is always a slingshot. I'm assuming that just hasn't changed, and I'm not gonna bother checking right now. I wonder if the barrels are the exact same, if they spawn on the same tile the same day. I wonder if it's still a tile set, or if it's, uh, actually a percent chance every time you break one. Uh, yeah, I assume the bookseller is crazy. I don't know how much XP the books actually give, though. That'd be something curious to look into and how fast you can level up skills with just straight-up money. I'm sure he has a cap on the amount of books you can buy, though.
You're eating raw egg? Yes. You're not making it into mayonnaise. Lost four fifty fifties there. Yippee. Uh shift and then right click an item. As long as it's droppable, it will drop. Uh for those wondering what I'm doing, I'm farming iron for sprinklers, so I can have a bunch of sprinklers for uh strawberries here in the coming days. Uh yeah. Just farming resources. Give me a magnet ring, please. I don't even want a weapon. I want a magnet ring. Please, magnet ring, please. Thank you. CFK, thank you for the rhyme. I'm kind of doing like the standard community center route at the start here, just because I think it's easiest. Oh, get me, it will ha allow me to have a decent footing. I'll probably do a few extra sprinklers and a few extra strawberries so I can do a few things. And then it's like, I'm obviously just gonna go out some silly days. But I think in terms of uh, setting up equipment, it's for the best. But I get the club. I got it from floor 20. I have the remix mines on, so I got it from uh, the chest, which honestly is very good because I did not get any weapons from any of the crates on the way down. Which would have been a little nightmarish to deal with. There's a book that lets you get all the food recipes instantly. How much money is that? <laughs> How much money is that book? Fifty K? It's not even expensive. The crates are random. Oh, that's good to know. That's actually so cheap. Year one perfection. Now Kent is still an issue with year one perfection. I have no idea when it's coming to Xbox. Yo, they could have made that cookbook literally half a million gold and I would still might call it cheap. The books are crazy. I'll check them out. I thought they were just going to be like XP books. Deep forest sword. Is there like a permanent moose speed one? That would be sick. Probably a little broken, but that would be sick. We're gonna have to check out that on the 21st. There is? That's insane. Only 15k? For a permanent move speed buff, 15k.
my guess for console updates is probably about two weeks. Two weeks to a month. Um Yeah, I'm just gonna go to I'm just gonna go to the egg festival at this point. Let me bring back everything to sell. Uh I gotta do a little bit of running. I got a lot of money. I'm just gonna go do the egg festival. I should also unlock the CC just to see what the bundles are real quick. I'm 100% doing the festival for the hat to put it on the dog as soon as I get it. That's all I will say. The dog's wearing that hat. My bundles are remixed, yes. That's why I'm curious about them. Uh, what do I want to keep? Probably those. Anything else that I realistically want to keep? Yeah, I'll keep that. The Meadows Farm, you get 15 hay from the parsnip chest instead of 15 parsnips, and you start with a coop with two animals that I think have uh, in sync names. Because mine was Chip and Dip, and I heard little er, Simsy had different named chickens, but I assumed they were also a, a scheme. What's different about this version's perfection? There's just new items that you have to do instead. There's also a, uh, there's also a way to just do Joja and pay for all the perfection stuff instead of actually having to do it which i will do eventually not now uh yeah i'm just gonna sell all this because i don't really care i'll probably keep an aqua just in case but oh i already have a few aquas never mind and we're gonna sell these This is going to be done. Uh, probably shortly after. Because it shouldn't actually be that bad. Good money. We got a lot of money for strawberries, chat. We're going to the 13th now. Uh, and when I say that, I mean I'm going to... Pluck these carrots. 70 energy? I'm selling it because I'm curious what the sell price is. Alright. Uh, I gotta wait for the community center cutscene. Is that the new worms? What is that gross thing right there? No, those are the worms. What is, what is that gross thing? Uh, one stone, thank you. Ew! Oh, never mind. <laughs> Those things are broken. Various wild grass and worms. It's kind of cool. All right, I forgot. Okay, we gotta wait until eight to get this cutscene. I'm gonna go, go to the bathroom real quick.
chat. Chat. Not gonna lie. I haven't even gotten to any of the new content yet. And this is probably the most fun I've had playing Stardew in like the past year. Not gonna lie. I'm literally like a kid on Christmas right now. Actually a kid on Christmas. <laughs> This is such a... <laughs> I haven't even done the new content and I'm just fucking excited for it. Open up that. The JoJo? Yeah, I know that. I, I read that. All right, I'm very curious what the new bundles are. Did you plant carrots? Yes, I grew one up and they give 70 energy, 75 energy. Like, hello? 75 energy? Huh? I also sold one because I want to know how much it sells for. Like, bruh, it takes three days to grow. That's That, that has to just be broken, right? Thirty-five. Don't sell them. Don't sell them. They're worthless to sell. Don't ever sell them. <laughs> Greetings. I am the queen of sauce. You already know how to cook that. You make her strat. <gasps> Puppy! Hello, Hobbs. See this dog here? The bark animation didn't really go off very well. Poor thing. Eh, I'll adopt it. Snooch is the name. Well, Yogi time. How do you get carrot seeds? I got them from crates in. Uh, also, apparently you could skip that. I saw the skip thing, but I'm not gonna do that. Uh. gonna make room for him uh so i've been reading chat slowly apparently if you get your friendship with the dog or your animal up you can adopt more so we might do that if i remember i'm not gonna be very good at remembering i'm gonna be quite honest chat how many more i do not know i was just told that you can get more There's no cave. I think it's behind the coop. I think it's behind the coop, but I could be wrong. Uh... Hey, Farmer Hobbs, 500 gold to the wizard. I should empty my inventory. Where's the exit on this map? How bad is it? Oh, the cave is down here. Oh, that's so far. That's kind of gross. There's so much grass on this map. I guess it's a little scuffed, it feels like. That's different. That's different. There is something there 1000%. Saying that you couldn't walk there before, I'm going to tend to agree with you. Is it just me or does this feel different? This looks different. This is just the ground. You are definitely more planted out here. I'm gonna lose my voice if I read this chat. Like, I can already like feel my voice getting dry from how much I've been talking today. I really can't do cutscenes, chat. I'm sorry. 
It's just going to be the same old cutscene. I guarantee it. So I'm going to skip it. You can have fun with it on your own. I'm not too worried about it. This is different. Alrighty. Let's look at our crafts room. Spring Forge. All right, we got to get a spring onion, and we're, we don't need a daffodil. Sap. Sap. Good day. Fall Forge. Nothing new. Exotic. Nothing new. Summer Forge. Nothing new. Winter Forge. Nothing new. Uh... Well, that sucks. We didn't get anything new. <laughs> you chose Revex? I got Sap. Restart? No. <laughs> At the bottom right, I'm well aware of the new door. I already know what's in it as well. The 21st is the bookseller, yes. I'm aware of this door. Drink some mayo, save your voice. If you want to go in the door, you need level 10 in every skill, which is our goal now. Add on thing for the prime. You see the new waterfall on the right side of town? I have not. Do we want to see the new waterfall on the right side of town, Chad, and waste more time? Speed run, by the way. Yes. 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 Okay. Chad, if I don't get world record, I'm blaming you guys. I wish I would do this when I had more move speed. Time save for next run. Okay, buddy. Fuck off and just do it. <laughs> we have faith. No, casual used to it <laughs> guys if he doesn't get world record he has to do it again i'm gonna do it again anyways <laughs> because i'm not optimal about this somebody said there's shit behind joji cola anyways Wh oh is this where the bookseller is oh that's a pretty waterfall yeah that's a pretty waterfall. Now it makes more sense than it, like, going up into the stream. Go nearer. I don't know if the screen will go up any higher in general. Oh, it does. Not pretty. That makes more sense now. Yeah, from the mountain lake. Because it didn't really make that much sense before. Yeah, he really changed the edge, edging of these pixels. Because this this used to be a lot, like, rougher. Or, I'm sorry, this looks more rougher now. Because it used to be, like, it was just the same pattern repeating on the sides here. Oh, somebody is... Oh, uh, what is it? I need to go to floor... I need to see how many of the uh, cave a uh, sprite things he he fixed because <laughs> i pointed out so many in that one video i wonder if he went back and fixed the majority of them i think he did i just don't know which ones Can you see the winter outfits you'll see them eventually all right we're going to uh He actually added more. That's fucking... That would be great. Woo. Oh, I needed to water these cave carrots. That's fine. Alright, we're gonna do... So, we need 60... Uh, 16, 20, 24, uh, uh, that's wrong, 24, 28, 32, uh, 36, 40. 
Uh, we'll actually keep this open for uh, 40, 44, 48, uh, 52. Uh, 55. I probably won't just... Well, I kind of want to, but I don't want to get rid of the care. Uh, this would be 46. I think that's good enough. Uh, this is gonna suck. Am I even farming level one? I am. Oh, oopsie. Uh, this is gonna suck to water. Suck, suck. Uh, I should probably empty my inventory in case if I get anything. Eat. Sorry to say, mobile and console probably won't get it for another two weeks to a month. Based off of how uh, last updates went. This doesn't look changed. Well, I need at least one. 56 is fine. Yeah, this don't look changed. There's the patch notes already. I hey, how the eggs don't spawn, like, before you go. I wonder... Let's see if the eggs changed. He said there is more eggs, so 18 eggs is possible. I'm going to do the standard route and just see how many I pick up along the way. That egg couldn't be seen. I don't know why he would add more eggs. We really need more eggs? I haven't really seen any more eggs. Maybe I do. I guess there's an egg right there. I don't really feel like there is more eggs, but maybe I'm delusional. Are there actually more eggs? Uh, until I don't feel like playing anymore, which will probably be a while from now. Yeah, chat, if you're here to listen or read the new, like, chat or the new fucking lines that the NPCs say or have NPC interaction, this is not the place. I'm going to be skipping a lot. I really just want to see the new content and just, like, go. Definitely not the place for it. Um, no. Wait, how many do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, only fourteen. This is going to be horrendous, by the way.
There is new dog types. I had to. Oh, so apparently they don't get in your way as much anymore, so... Blue grass, it's a part of this farm. The animals enjoy it more or whatever. There's gonna be a lot of watering. I'm kind of coping that I get level 2 farming off of petting, uh... Oh well, would be handy. <laughs> Unironically, it would be. But I'm kind of coping that I get level 2 farming off of the animals. Real quick here. Yes, this is the farm that starts with a coop. Okay, yeah, we're just trying to get as much money as possible, as fast as possible, so we can uh buy start buying stuff. So is there iridium scythe? Yes, and it's locked behind getting level ten in every single skill. And then some. And let me tell you, those who have been asking for a very specific mod to be added to the game, it has been added. Pam Horse. Everybody loves Pam Horse. Which mod? Skull Cavern Elevator confirmed. Let's let... We are talking about a scythe. Put, put two and two together. What does everybody want the scythe to do? Yes. It is fucking broken. We're, we're supposed to know math. Uh-oh. <laughs> Scythable crops is with the iridium scythe. The only issue is the scythe is locked behind that door that I'm trying to open. Which honestly is a very good lock. Ain't gonna lie. It's not something you can realistically brute force fast as a speedrunner. Oh. <gasps> I don't have the water anymore. I don't have the water after this day, chat. Actually, I don't even think I need a water anymore because I could have skipped two days. I'm going to water just because. It'll annoy me otherwise. Level two. Did anybody else see what I can make, chat? <laughs> no. Actually, I kind of have to do it for science because I want to see the drinking animation. That hits everything. Um. All right, chat. I'm gonna I'm gonna waste time doing this just for you, just for you, chat. I wonder if he fixed salmon berries dropping incorrectly. 
Uh, or, I'm sorry, the log out feature of salmon berries. I did do remix bundles, yes. Probably run around and go pick up a bunch of salmon berries. I'll get one of those later. Berries now give XP. Oh, that's kind of broken. Eric, thank you for the prime. There was a mushroom there. The mushroom cave now comes with a free dehydrator. Ooh, that's kind of a buff. I don't know how good dehydrators are, though. Like, normally I'm not a fan of him adding a bunch of kind of, like, seemingly useless machines, but a lot of them seem fun this update. Like, I feel like that was, like, a lacking part of 1.5. A lot of the new machines just weren't useful and just way too late in the game to, like, be enjoyable. And it's like, ho hoppers were basically completely useless. And it's like, deconstructors were, like, the only, like, semi-good one, in my opinion. And the rest were kind of just, like, eh. Geocrushers got used in uh, speedruns, but no one else used them. Geocrushers, no coal? <laughs> yeah, okay, apparently that's a thing. That's that's busted as well. But it's like, I feel like a lot of the machines that at least I've seen so far look fun or at least interesting in some regard. And that was like the issue with them. I'm going to run around and get more salmon berries as I wait for this to finish. This is the last day of salmon berry season. I would like a lot of salmon berries for uh end of the day here. End of the season here. How do we use it? You need level 10 in every or yeah, level 10 in every skill. And then you can open it. Oh, by the way, here's the here's to elaborate on what I was talking about earlier. Uh, the new maps and how they got love. I don't know if he changed any of like the layouts in particular, but the 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 Riverland farm now spawns with a uh, a smoker. You get a smoker at the start of the Riverlands farm in the house, and the the combat farm now once you hit level nine spawns Iridium Wilderness golems. Which I think have better loot drops. I don't know what their loot drops are, but they're better. Those are the touch-ups that I'm talking about. Like, it's love, but they're still the worst farms. <laughs> Let's be real. Little bit of touch-up. Wait. <laughs> Wait, you don't even need to click on it anymore. Wait a minute. Who wants to bet that using a scythe to pick these up uh, doesn't give XP because it's bugged? <laughs> Who wants to bet? Ooh, oh, wow, this looks so much nicer. Holy, holy moly, this looks so much better. He even cleaned up all the trash down here, so it doesn't look nearly as bad. Oh, that's so nice. That's so pretty. Also, I do like how the grass now goes to the edge of some of these areas. It makes it feel more complete. Uh, trash bear we shall see there still seems to be trash over here i think trash bear was like added on to i think he does more than just what he used to
down too much here. Trash Bear spawns at the start of year three. Salmonberry for energy. Energy, and I might have a bundle with it later on. I should realistically finish the... I should go turn in the... Spring Forge so I can see what uh, other bundles I have. Real quick. Uh... Egg. You. Matinees. Matinees. Go turn this in real quick. There is a... You can't buy them. There's carrots. I've gotten carrots so far. Mayo. A glug sap too. Oh, you can get carrots. I got them from crates in a mines. And there's these new special like worm tiles. That I got them from. Mayo heals like 200 energy. Really? It sounds like spring seeds. Oh, good. You can still animation cancel out of this. All right, what bundles do we got? I don't like that dark blue. I've not seen that before. Okay, so I need to keep a carrot. No Kali. Uh, we do this here too. That's fine. That's some weird qu quality crops right there. Summer is normal. Ew. Ew. Pretty normal. Brewer's bundle. Juice. Oh, juice got to glow up. It's its own thing now. Juice got a little bit of a glow up. And what is this? Fisher farm. Ew. <sighs> got to make a... Ah, it's so gross. I have to make this now. Ah, oh, this is so gross. I hate making- I hate having to make one of those. Hey, at least I don't need animals. Well, I mean, at least not that I know of yet. Can't grow a green bean anymore in time. Oh, we also got the fish tank. River. I gotta catch catfish. Oh, wait, no, that was always a part of it. Standard river. Nighttime, lake, specialties in the middle for whatever reason, ocean, crab pot, wait. I literally got the default of everything! Why are these two bundles switched? This is the default of everything! <laughs> these two bundles are switched in their s positions! There are only two random bundles there. Yeah, but I was hoping to get a new one. Good morning, Blade. You gotta remember, the 20th is where the bookseller comes in. 21st. Alright, let's sleep until then. Or... Um, Alright, first off... 50 energy. Alright. Chat. <laughs> what is the animation? It's actually chugging it. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, you actually just chug it. Oh, that's gross. Ah. Oh, oh no. No. No, no, no. Oh, that is no. 
That is not an instrument. Booksellers today. No chat. Uh, it was on the board, and apparently it just says it on the bottom. We got a bookseller on the 21st and on the 25th here, and then this is the holiday that I missed. Oh, it has a little, even a little thing. Alright, I want to read some of these books. Apparently these books... My first bookseller was the 12th. Ooh, so they're random. That's kind of interesting. Mining monthly. Read this to gain some experience. Combat quarterly. Read this to gain some combat experience. Way of the wind. Run a little bit faster for 15k. Part 1! You can get more?! Horse book. Gain a little extra speed. You will now run a lot faster through grass. That's nice. Price catalog. You can now see the value of your items. Oh, that's kind of nice. <laughs> Wait a minute. Part one? I don't have the move. To I oh, oh. <laughs> save up for the twenty fifth. No, but I need blueberries. You need more money, so I can just. I need to be able to constantly be affording more crops while being able to buy books, and that's like the thing that I need to be able to do. The bro cooks so hard he burns his food to a crisp. This is this is he is speed running the new update or slow running it. Uh, slow running it to be quite fair because I'm checking out a bunch of sh stuff as I go, and I'm having fun with it. It's definitely a slow run, but I'm still sleeping days and skipping the stuff with strawberries. Something new to sleep on. I do like how it tells you that you leveled up without having to look now, though. I must admit, that is very nice. Um... Uh, okay, game thing for the raid. I should... Uh, what should I do? Like, I want to chop down trees because my brain is telling me to start making a... Uh, oak resin farm, but... I don't know if that's necessarily the best thing to do right now. I kind of feel like I should just be sleeping days and trying to make as much money as possible. And just trying to complete the community center. I don't really care how many years it takes me. But I don't want to sleep too many days for the farm to get overcrowded, and I have to deal with it later. The other... The other issue is the fact that, uh... Um, I don't have that much farming space, which kind of blows. I feel like I gotta do more mining still. I gotta get more resources because i'm gonna need a lot of money to be able to pay for stuff i want to make a lot of jars going into uh summer yeah i gotta go mining what i gotta do I don't want to sell. I don't want to sell the strawberries yet for the backpack upgrade because I want the ten percent increase, 
Move my house. I guess that is true. I can move my house now, can't I? Cat on dog? Oh, you're right. I should have done that. I'll do it when I walk back. What do books do? They gain you XP. I just don't know how much. Wait. This is new. I saw this bridge and I was very confused for... Is that a Korok? I don't care about the Mystic Stone. Is that a Korok? <laughs> okay. Pole node? Uh, I need iron and copper, so I'm just gonna... I mean, I could probably brute force a lower floor with the pickaxe that I have, but I'd rather just wait until I have an upgraded pickaxe to make it easier on me. Wait, I don't know what that is. Borok seeds? Monka S? Oh. Oh, Korok. Oh, you're doing a Zelda reference. I'm slow. Dad, thank you for the two months. All right, we gotta get resources, chat. We gotta be able to supply our farming empire. I know we selected a farm that is supposed to focus on animals, but I'm going to specifically choose not to focus on animals and do farming because it's just better. <laughs> Sorry to say. Uh, It does what the famous mod does. That's what the Iridium Scythe does. And it does, in fact, not have a larger Scythe radius than the regular Scythe. Or the Golden Scythe, which shares the exact same Scythe radius. Thank you, Wiki, for being wrong. Oh, seven. Hi. How do you obtain the scythe? There's a door in, uh... There is a door in Cindersap that is locked behind having level 10 in every skill. How do you get the stuff after you go through the door? Gain more XP. What's the new menu for? Uh, this tells this is your new wallet. This is animals to tell you which one you've pet and what their friendship is, and then this is uh. Uh, this is just telling you stuff. So this tells you you're at level uh, 45. I'm at level 45 in the mines. My house is level 1. This involves the new uh, room. And then I think this is probably star drops. But I can't tell. 
This looks like a star drop to me, but I don't know. I don't know what that last one is. Mine says seven out of seven, then it's star drop. They removed it. There's a setting to re-enable it, but... Uh, it's not its default. Uh, oh, you're right. This could be, uh... Yeah, crafts room, fish tank, pantry. Oh, these are the community center tabs. And then I think this is the new, uh, XP thing. All right, we need more copper now. I'm doing what a lot consider to be the most unforgivable sin, and I am not even going to bother with quality sprinklers, and we are only going to be using basics, because basics are broken in this game, contrary to popular belief. Basic sprinklers, OP, OP. Uh, no, basics are broken. I would argue for the point in time that you get uh, each sprinkler type, basics are the best sprinklers in the game. But for the point in time that you get each sprinkler type, basic sprinklers are by far the best sprinklers in the game. It's not even comparable. Iridiums are way too late and very expensive with how fast you get level 9 in uh, comparison. And then, uh, Iridium kind of, or uh, quality are a little too late because, uh, you generally need to save a bunch of energy early on. And by the time that you get quality, energy is not really an issue anymore. But you have basics and it cuts off being me having to water. Like, you're, you're going to convince me that you want to hand water those 60 strawberries every single day and not be able to do anything else for the remainder of spring. Look at me. I'm watering 60 strawberries and gathering more resources for sprinklers right now. To craft more. It's wild. It's actually so busted. And then I don't have to worry about going down to floor 80 for gold. Why would you phase them out though? Like, think about it this way. You, yes, but you the same argument can be applied to quality then. You phase out quality sprinklers, so they're shit. You can't, you can't even say that. You phase out quality sprinklers for Iridium. So that, that, that argument is null and void. Why would you phase them out? They're, they still work. Once you get, once you can craft quality sprinklers, they still, basic sprinklers still work. They don't turn off. The, the, you know, your water company doesn't go like, no, you can't use basic sprinklers anymore. We're going to turn them off. You got to get rid of them. They still work. You can still use them. Bro's arguing with himself. I'm kind of delusional. Leave me be. Oh, wait. Bon oh. Rip that crate. This 
sprinkler of slander. That's gonna be one of my rant videos this year, guaranteed. Literally ranting about how broken sprinklers are. That said, the meta is probably slightly changed with these books. Because these books seem like you could probably get XP much faster because of them. So it's a interesting change to say the least, but we'll see how it feels, obviously. Does XP even do? It levels you up faster, so you can get higher skill levels quicker. You need 15,000 XP for each skill to get to to get to level 10. So if you have a book that gives 1,000 XP, that's one-fifth of the way. Surely these books don't give 1,000 XP, but if they gave 500, that's still one-tenth for a book. 500 XP is the equivalent of catching what? Five, le five legendary fish, which give about 100 XP each. That's a lot. Even a book that is worth 100 fishing XP is the equivalent of catching the legend. In terms of XP. In a book. Oh no, that sounds kinda... I did drink more. I did drink. Alright, we're gonna do one... Uh, copper smelt and then one iron smelt each day that we sleep here. So we're kind of just going to have to wait a little bit. Because I need these... I need... I want these sprinklers done before summer. And then, uh... Yeah, I want these... I want these sprinklers done by summer. Flower dance? Why would I go to the flower dance? Sure, there could be something new, but I'll go later. I'm not worried about it. I want to get the I want to get the run kick started to get to check out the new books and whatever. I also missed the book seller, but it's fine. Hey, pet dog. Yeah. Hat on dog. Thank you. He's so cute. Oh, wait, the booksellers today. I'm going to reset because I just want to check something out. I love the new... Oh, there's like a new little hourglass thing there. That's kind of cool. All right, I just want to see if the... I want to see what stock changes. That was earlier. Uh, yeah, you probably could. I wonder what these stars mean. Probably try to do those every so often. I won't do the fishing ones, but every I'll check. If you complete a quest, you get a prize at Lewis's house. That's interesting. Book of Stars. Read this book to gain some experience in all skills. 15,000. Combat quarterly. Stardew Omnac. Read this to gain some farming experience. Mining monthly. I feel like it shifts. Some of these are the same, but some of them, there's more. You know, I'm very curious how much XP they give because they feel really expensive. Julianne, thank you for the tier one. They feel really expensive if they give not that much, especially the farming ones. The farming ones are so easy. Like, I could, I can see buying like 500 worth of combat XP for 15,000 being all right, but not like farming. If it's plus one level, that is really strong. Especially later on. If it's plus one level, like, 
to get from level 9 to 10 is the equivalent of getting from level 1 to like 6. 1 to 7. You need 5,000 XP to go from level 1 to 10. You need 10,000... I'm sorry. To, you need 15,000 XP to go from 1 to 10. You need 10,000 XP to go from to go to go from 1 to 9. And then you need 5,000 XP to go from 9 to 10. You get 5,000 XP for that book then. Is your game running a mod that is the amount? Uh, no, I'm just... I'm running at 2k, actually. I have a 2k res. Well, you can't see the exact amount of XP that you're missing, so you can't really totally see it. Is more of the issue. Uh, they're probably starving. I just don't really care. It is. I'm not going to do it in one sitting. It's probably going to be over the course of like two or three days. We're just going to chill and do it. It's caught river jelly. Interesting. I can buy the book of move speed with, his, with this buddy that I just got. One book, chat. One book. <laughs> uh, until I get bored, which will probably be a while. One book. Right, I'm going to wait for that to smell, and I got to go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Buy it? No. <laughs> I need blueberries. No VOD of the beginning of the run. I mean, should be. Unless Twitch decided to disable things again. Would be annoying. All right. To summer we go. Yeah, well. I need 
and uh, move this scarecrow. Can I hoe here? No. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen. this is enough to cover everything. How many have I crafted already? So we're gonna craft 30. 30 times 4. Uh, 12. 120? Hundred twenty plus er uh, hundred twenty hundred twenty minus uh melon or minus two spots, so one eighteen. One hundred and eighteen. Those are booksellers. Trout Derby Okay. We'll check those out. Bookseller 12th and 25th. Unfortunately, we're probably going to skip this one because we won't have money. Route Derby 20th and 21st. Uh, good to see Gus still. Uh, I'm looking for somebody to bring me five coal to see if any rare gems are hidden inside. Oh, he has coal quests now. I guess I can do that. This thing? All right, well, first things first. You, you. But then you. Um, and then... Oh, that's too many, but I don't really care. Does it mean Geode? I don't know. Maybe he's looking for diamonds. Well, it's kind of annoying to get, though. Not gonna lie. Out of everything he could request... Kind of probably the worst. finish uh well i didn't want to buy that money but it's like three buttons it's weird uh i can do one more Perfect. 
Uh-huh. Oh, you're right. Oh, it's good enough. Uh, do I need to do anything else? I'll probably go out later to get the spring or summer forge. I want to sleep a few days. I love how there's a little sound cue at the bottom left. You guys can't really see because of chat, but there do be a sound cue. A few days into the season. Um... 500 is... Uh, I guess I slept over the coal quest, didn't I? That's well, kind of wild. I didn't get uh, any forage in the bus stop. When's the environmental? I don't know. That one was for the... What is it called? That one was for the spa opening. Robin sells big chest. Oh, that's interesting. Sometime this month. Huh. He doesn't sell it all the time. What's the benefit of the new grass? I think it gets more friendship value when they eat it or whatever. Or they get set in a better mood. Actually, no. Grass already sets mood to max. I think you just get friends with them faster, but I don't know how much the bonus is. I don't really think it's that good. From what I've seen of it. That said, I've been kind of ignoring the animals. He wants 10 coal now. I've been kind of ignoring the animals because they just get outdated so quickly. It's just not really worth my time. It do be pretty. Treasure hunter. It's a little annoying, but it's fine. This is okay. It sucks that I can't do 10 bat wings, but it doesn't matter, and that's fine. A treasure hunter. I'm pretty sure that was a thing before. There's a new book in the Adventurer's Guild. It's in a blue present box in the backwoods. And it's free. Yeah. Interesting. I'm fine with spoilers like that that I would just never find myself. By the way, I would just end up watching a video of somebody else finding it. One of those things. I don't really look in a venture like that. Vault never changes. Spoiler, if you get 10 hearts with Pam, she becomes Pam Horse. Are you fermenting mayo? Uh, yes. Gonna be the juiciest mayo anybody's ever drank. No, the new farm type is terrible for speedruns. The issue with every other farm type in speedruns is literally how do you get the purple mushroom? 
And that's the issue with it. Uh, then you screw yourself on Artisan for the speedrun. Because do you really want to spend an extra 20k on trees? Wizard would just end up being killing two ghosts. Gotta wait until two. Yeah. Forest farm and fruit bats. The best solution. <laughs> yes. The best and fastest solution. I need to get coal. Wait, no, I don't. Not part of that. Kind of just sitting here waiting for the Adventurers Guild to open. Uh, did you pick up mushrooms? I haven't gotten, uh, asked yet. I also like how it tells you the day here now. This is definitely new. I hate how it's a different text font, but why? Why is this different? How much sap do I need? 500. You can leave the ice festival now. That's super nice. We're kind of waiting until 2. Because I want to see what this book is. Um, we already laid out a plan for the speed run. I'm kind of just going with the flow. If something catches my eye because of the new update, I do it. If not, uh, you know, I'm kind of just doing a regular CC run right now, but with the remix settings. I'm not really trying to complete it fast per se. As you can see, it's like somebody told me that there's a book in the Adventurers Guild in the back room. So now I'm literally waiting for the Adventurers Guild to open up, even though like I could just do this later on and do it during a more efficient time. Can we check the spy area? Sure, why not? Somebody just gives me a suggestion and I kind of just do it. Looks the same. I wish I had my hoe on me, but looks the same. Uh, there's moss on this tree. Wait a minute. Also, why does this look like something new? It doesn't. It looks like there was like a cave entrance there. Moss too. I don't know. I'm getting an axe because I figured I would need an axe. Drink mayonnaise, please. I already have. They go too. Well, oh well. Moss, a special type of plant that grows in shady areas. Huh. I wonder what it's used for. Probably craftables. That seems really annoying to farm, not gonna lie. Can't eat, zero out of ten, true. Alright, so whoever fucking baited me telling me to walk in there is a... Uh, I'll see what he has to buy. I didn't know that was a thing. Ball sword's kind of cool. The core sword. Kind of a bait, not gonna lie. Bro, there it is. Yeah, I saw it, but I can't get into the back rooms until I kill a thousand monsters. I literally clicked on the door and it said must kill a thousand monsters to enter this room. Somebody's playing on a on a farm that they've already played on.
I need a new farm building. Oh, I love how it tells you the amount of days now. I don't know if I'm a fan of this new gold pile. Pet bull. That's a very expensive pet bull. Oh, that's interesting. Slime Hutch got to make over a little bit. I do enjoy that the cabins don't take up three spaces now. Oh, he's added more too. <laughs> the fucking RV. <laughs> uh, big chest, 5k. Oh, that's kind of expensive. Oh, you can buy all these at once now too, which is nice. Make Pam farm, please. Yeah. All right, checked out the Adventurers Guild. Uh, I mean, I won't have any money for the books, so it's kind of just a sleep until. Uh, the fishing derby angle. There's a few new cabins. What is perfection? Uh, you can buy waivers for it, but I'm gonna choose not to, because I think it's more fun. You can check out Marnie's too. Uh, yeah, so I'll check it when I go check out the books. Uh, I hope he did. I don't know if he knows about that. I don't think I ever told him. And that's a very specific soft lock. There's moss on some of my trees now. Blueberries. Moss. I wonder if it gives XP. I don't know how moss works, but it didn't spawn in spring, so I feel like it might be a summer thing. So I should probably try to pick up as much as I can ASAP. everywhere. Holy moly. This is like semi a waste of time though. I can just do it later. I chop it off. I wonder how this works with tappers.
tree is still very suspicious. I'll just pick up some of it. I don't need all of it. Scythe for moss? Okay. That make things a bit easier. Does club work or does it have to be scythe? Oh no, club works. That makes things easier. Okay, we got the fishing derby next. Funny. Yeah, I think the fishing derby is next. Green rain has descended. My trees are a little creepy now. This sounds bad. Is everybody all right? Is everybody drugged up? Is this like a normal thing? Like, it is, I feel like this would be a fucking fever dream. It's coming off the trees. Moss. Mossy. This can be planted to grow, grow rare wild trees. Hello? Well, I guess I really didn't need to worry about getting a bunch of moss. Plant that and see what happens. Uh, how does this change the town? Uh -huh. Are we like in a dream? Like, surely the villagers comment on this, right? There's, there's just. You can get. Why, why, why is he not at the shop? Are they like? Panic? God, no customers anymore because of this green rain on my leisure will be in the red. I want to go exploring, but I I can tell my mom is the kind that worries and don't want to add to her stress levels. I've never seen green rain before. It must not it, it must not be too dangerous if if you made if you made it here. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? What the what the hell is going on? Lewis. Lewis. Uh, 
Oh, you can't spam click it. I was hoping you could spam click it. What are these tickets? Y'all. Yo, wait. Algo, you're saved on fucking Fiddlehead Fur and stuff. He's probably streaming, but Algo saved. The Fiddlehead Ferns isn't going to be a pain anymore. I love how he just has like two ore nodes here. Where's Clint? Where is everybody? He just finished Ferns? Oh boy. Wait, where is everybody? Check the wizards. I'll walk to the wizard and then I'm gonna walk to the pub. Okay, everybody's in here. Are you alright? We've never seen anything like this before. I want to go outside and play, Mom. What is... What? Is it acid? Will it burn through the roof and sizzle us alive? Can I keep my little brother safe? Bless CA. They now have a double bed. They now have a double bed. Bless. Alright. Uh, I'll go to the pub and then see ya, or then the wizard. Am I draining my energy? No, I was using energy. Oh, everybody is at the pub. It's a sign from the almighty, we are doomed. Even Pam is scared. Are you alright? We're all wondering what's going on. Brought some medical supplies just in case. I hope weird rains don't bother the fish. It can ruin me life. I just got off the phone with the governor. Apparently, this rain is supposed to be completely harmless. Just an unusual phenomenon of nature. Still, there, there's some townsfolk panicking, which is never good. Saw the weather report last night. It really gave me the scare. I gotta talk to them all. Okay. What do you get when you fish now? That's something I'll figure out later. I don't really want to fish. Beach. <sighs> I guess I could go up to other areas. Wizards. I blame the Junimos, yes. Oh god. I mean, this is a good way to get a lot of fiber at the very least. And fiddleheads. Wizard, can you explain anything to me? Mixed flower seeds. The assortments of flower seeds. Plant them to see what grows. Interesting. Though the unusual rains may be alarming, there is nothing to fear this day. In fact, it's a day of great joy for many living things. You're useless. This weekend, summer 20th to 21st, come prove your freshwater skills and win prizes. Note any personal items found near the sign will be sent to the lost and found. Got 
Drop one down, I did. You get fiddlehead ferns. I have like 12 of them. Environmental. This is... Beach seems normal. Ain't fishing. That was actually a really good beach, by the way. Probably. I just don't know what it is. Green rain is seeded to the file. How often does it occur? Like once a summer? Once a year in summer. Okay. I wonder if it stays changed in any way. Very interesting. Hello, Demetrius. Sorry to say, guys. Not really. Bat search is better. Elbozos. I wonder if moss is summer only. I don't think I saw any in spring. You know, green rain seems funny because since no one works on the day, literally if you ran on this patch and you had to do something in summer, there's just a random chance that it just completely kills your run. Plant summer squash yet? I don't need that. Yeah, I don't need that. I haven't gotten any. I haven't been into the mines. I haven't gotten any artifact spots. Worry about that stuff later. Uh, alright. Tomorrow is the fishing derby. Uh, I'm gonna... I still get two more harvests. I'm fine. It probably does. I guess it's not gonna show anymore, but it probably does. All right, let's head down. The annual Trout Derby has begun. All right, so what, what, what does it want me to do? Stage 14 to grow moss normally. Okay, that's interesting. Get reward. Explanation. During this event, Rainbow Trout have a chance of carrying golden tags. If you find one, turn it in here for a prize. I kind of want to talk to these guys now. Fisherman, I came all the way from Grimpleton for this. I think I'm a little overdressed for this event. Of course, some guy has to show up wearing the same outfit as me. How embarrassing. <laughs> Fishing pro. I know it's not a competition, but still, whoever gets the most tags will have bragging rights for the rest of the year. Ah, uh, now this is the life. Nothing more than the twinkle or trinkle than a day of trout fishing. I can't pronounce words. Any luck? Most of the bites I'm getting are from from the mosquitoes. Ooh. Trout man. Where I come from, they call me Trout man. 
lovely. What did two girls? Fishing sisters. We are the fa famous fishing sisters. I feel a nibble. We'll fish as many fish as we wish. Nah, nah, nah. Uh, that's a song reference that I'm not picking up. I wonder if you're more likely to get rainbow trout here or in the... Town River. Is what you can get. Pike? What's the goal of this event? Apparently, if you catch a sunfish, there's a chance that it has a golden tag and you can turn it in for a reward. That's a Dorado. I feel like you're higher odds of getting rainbow trout in the town. That's cool. They actually have animations now. I wonder if we can see Willy fishing in the town to die. How do you make the specific bait? Somebody tell me that. Who knows? There will probably be... Well, yeah, I mean, I should be able to equip it. I should go get a fiberglass fishing rod. I can buy one. I'm level 2 fishing. I hope Willie is working today. Oh, it's a Saturday. He's not. Fuck! Fish in a bait machine. I probably don't have access to that. He probably doesn't work on these days. I just want to get one. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go fish in town. I think. I'm gonna get one rainbow trout and then, or try to get one golden tag. Just see what the reward is, and then probably try it again next year when I have more fish or when I have more uh, bait and an upgraded fishing pole, so it doesn't take nearly as long. Amico, thank you for the 28. Because it's like without a fiberglass fishing rod, it like takes forever. Aw. I didn't get a tag. PA 1.6. Have love. Well, I know the color jelly is now a thing because uh, the I, the jelly and wine bottles are now colored based off of the fruit that you put it in instead of uh, just being the purple and red. Can you get the tag from a fish not near? It said rainbow trout, so I would assume anywhere. Rainbow Trout and River have much higher odds. There's less fish. Yeah. Midnight's Zaffir. Thank you for the prime. Yeah, I just said Rainbow Trout. And Kit. Used it. Use this to de deploy a one-time use tent for sleeping. Can only be used outdoors. This is cool, but it's kind of useless. Not gonna lie. <laughs> what? I think it's so you don't have to run back to sleep. Well... Yeah, nah, it's kind of still useless. You can sleep in the desert, which is really cool. But you do I don't know if there's going to be a TV inside, so you don't know what your daily luck the next day will be. So it's kind of cool and like I don't I don't know how much 
it'll get. I'll mess with the rewards later. It can be, but at the same time, it doesn't matter too much because I could pass out and just lose a thousand gold and I don't care. It's not collapsible. It's a one-time use. I don't think it's as useful as a lot of people think. It might have some really niche uses that could be really funny, but... Again, I don't think it'll be as insane as people might think. The new upper limit of gold loss is 15k. Okay, never mind. It's probably extremely useful. <laughs> huh? <laughs> All right, no more passing out. He's in a fucking plane now. <laughs> Mystery boxes can now be found. Dot, dot, dot. Well, I got more things to find now. When did we say the next uh, bookseller was? On the 25th. Yeah. Thank you. You know, CA wanted to add loot boxes into the game, but he wanted to show up to AAA developers and just make them free of charge to open instead of, uh, you know, pay to win. You want to add Gamba? Add it this way. Sticking, in, uh, sticking his nose up to them. What do you think is going to be in the boxes? I don't know. <laughs> Not deserving. I just wonder where you get them from. I would have guessed like you would get a random loot box from uh, harvesting crops, but apparently not. I would I expected to get one there. Keep some glue. I still have one more harvest. Uh, I can just turn them in now, so it's kind of fine. This is just going to unlock the vault, right? I'll pay for the cheap one. Oh, wait, no, it unlocks this. Nice. All right. Forger bundle. This is why we got the salmon berries. Okay, yeah, we got great salmon berries. Okay, we need a duck, which is fine. Iridium bar kind of sucks, but that's all right. Wow, we don't need a truffle. We just need a duck. We don't even need a rabbit's foot. Wow. I got really easy bundles. We need a cow, though. We need a cow. Wow, we got really easy bundles. You can get the monthly mining books from Killing Monsters AO. The books also give 250 XP. That's not bad. No cow needed. No, it was three, though. I'm pretty sure cow was needed. Yeah, you need all three. Three slots. Three slots. I think that was nerfed. Need an apple tree still. I need no pomegranate. Nor an artisan bundle. So technically me taking... I could have taken the mushroom cave and been fine. I'm not catching that guy, Atuna. Over my dead body. 25th. 
T saplings getting nerfed is making people cry. That's crazy. That's crazy that you're crying over kind of inferior way of making money. A fun yet inferior way. Sapling TV. <laughs> oh, sevens. Oh, I'm supposed to make a billion gold with T saplings? Yeah. Alright, to the 25th. I wonder where we get the. I have so much money now, though. I'm so happy. I'm not gonna go crazy and just overbuy books here, by the way. Like, I need money to be able to pay for pumpkins and jars. I'm not going to go crazy here. But I, I at least want to buy the move speed book. I want to try that. That's only 15k. Can't even read. I'm going to learn just for this. I don't care about backseating. From Blade, at least. I don't care about people telling me about things that I just won't find on my own. Like, somebody said there was a box in the back of the Adventurer's Guild. I never would have. I never would have noticed it. Jack be nimble, Jack be thick. Gang one defense. You now learned a new power. I can read V. Read in book. Oh, that's kind of cool. If you oh, so you can just find books like around town. Oh, this could be really strong. The Lux Bait. Kind of interesting. He changed the artwork for it. Early Monster Musk. Seems strong. I gotta buy this. We run a little bit faster. Not gonna lie, I don't really notice that that much. It's 30k! <laughs> I'm not buying that. Book of Stars, 15k? It's probably worth buying. Blade! Monster hunting? Yeah, Blade, how much XP does this give? Do you know what the book XP values are already? I don't want to spend 15k for like 100 XP in each skill. Two hundred each, no matter what, even like the monthly ones. What's the difference between the monthly and weekly? Or quarterly, whatever one it was. The name. <laughs> Just the name. <laughs> So 15k for 250 XP in each. So 15k for uh huh. I'll hold out. I don't think I need it just yet. All books are 250. Yeah, apparently. I'll hold out. I'm concerned about money. I'm going to be buying a lot of shit soon. I can buy stuff later. Books of Star applies to all scale specific ones. Or specifically ones on just that skill. Yeah, that's what I figured. There's a, oh yeah, I guess I never went through all these settings. I don't see it. Probably at the top. Background menu. Standards graphical. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. 
Okay. Not growing a radish. Trade 20 coal for a mining XP book. Isn't that ridiculously cheap? Where do you trade 20 coal for a mining XP book? I thought that was trading a mining XP book for 20 coal. When you have extras and you don't need it. Uh, yeah. Good to know the 26 still rains. What are the books? When you read them, you gain 250 XP in uh, whatever skill it says. Which doesn't, like, it seems like a lot, but it it's only a lot in specific skills. It's not a lot in farming. I don't think ever buying a farming XP book is worth it. But the fishing and combat ones. Actually, really just the fishing one is kind of like really good. The rest you can kind of like mass do. Yeah, the book the book speeds are great. Coffee is plus one. Yes. Yeah, I just need more money. I assuming there's four. Did they change uh, any of the crafting recipes for these items? Eggs still the same, jars still. The same. I just need more money. Yeah, it's kind of just 120. What is our, uh, we're gonna need to find the broccoli. I don't really know how to find it. I need broccoli. Broccoli, corn, and eggplants. I mean, I guess we're going to year two at this point for fishing, so it's not a huge thing. It's probably just like carrots. I love how there's fungus growing on these uh, moss trees now. The ninth. Heal. It better be raining tomorrow. Pull it up on Jojo Colas. It's a 21 second speed buff. That sounds like good and bad at the same time. I don't know how I feel about that. Is it really worth spending the the money on that? I mean, twenty one seconds isn't that bad, but bro is already in fall. I'm on spring twelve. Yep, it's called sleeping days.
I don't know how to get the mystery boxes. The new prize machine feature. I don't know how it works yet. I'd assume it's like the same way the secret notes are found. Is like my just instant assumption about it. But I do not know. game explanation missed the spot it happens it happens to the best of us water this just because there's actual water in this already i really feel like i need to start cutting down more trees also i love how the fences have all decayed already Blacksmith can open this for you. Who might know what's inside? Do I really have to go all the way to Clint's to open it? Oh, God. Well, they're made by Mr. Key, so I would assume they're tougher than you would think. all the way over for this. Yeah, predictor's probably not updated yet. It might be, though. Nothing's been optimal about this run B. We're just checking out all the new stuff when we see it. Clint paid Mr. Key for this, true. That felt really lackluster. <laughs> 10 hardwood. <laughs> I did all that for a 10 hardwood chat. to the ninth <laughs> banger of a box that hardwood is not that bad it's pretty bad well it's not that bad because i'm not because i'm not on forest farm if i was on forest farm that would be pretty bad i mean to be fair a lot of geodes are kind of just depressing to get or to open late game so that's not really like the thing that matters Construction bundle that I don't have. I have sap bundle.
I need like I only need ten uh I should only need ten preserve jars. To go through 120 pumpkins. I already ate the mayo. I'm now just kind of torturing people. It's literally the drinking animation. I wonder if there's new, uh, quests. What changed in 1.6? A lot. I can't even begin to tell you how much has changed. Community cleanup. These are both quests I do not want to do right now. It will never let you eat the jar. No, apparently not. Bait and bobber. I really need that. Way of the wind part two. Oh, there's no point of buying that. Uh, Woodcutter weekly. Probably should have bought that book last week. Uh... It really does not feel worth buying this this early. I'm going to buy this just because it's 3k. Oh, that's so nice. Holy shit. Like, I have mods. These books feel so expensive looking at it. It's like, I'm I'm questioning my mind. Do I want to pay 10k? Yeah, I do. Fishing sucks. <laughs> fishing, I think fishing books and combat books, not even combat. It's just fishing books are like the worst or like the best. That fishing book, like I paid 10k for like five fish worth of XP. Or what? Uh, how many how many crab pop things did I just pay 10k for? Oh, I feel so bad, but money doesn't matter. Uh, it's the equivalent of harvesting 50 crab pots. Forge's best book. Why? Why would Forge be best book? Special worms. We got our broccoli. Eight days to harvest. My for foraging strat. They fixed the the issue on Ginger Island. I mean, I'm gonna assume I get to Ginger Island before I get to combat level ten. It's gonna take forever. Let's be real. I don't really need the Iridium Scythe until I get Ancient Fruit going or Star Fruit going. I think Star, I think Ancient Fruit will be faster now purely for the fact that you don't have to reharvest and you can just scythe everything instead. I can't imagine foraging XP being that much better. You know, 
I decided to take a drink of water, thinking Robin was going to walk to her counter, not realizing that it's a Tuesday, and she walked right past me. You only get two forge per crop. They nerfed that? Really? Interesting. I didn't read that. Moss soup cookout kit. Can I craft moss soup? I guess it's a, it did say the cooking recipe. That's not worth. I should eat, or I should fish today. I got literally the default fish bundle, so I can just do the CC fishing route and be fine. Maybe I'll catch enough trash. Probably not. Oh, we're good on crab pot items already. Don't need any more. I want to see what the new Steam achievements are real quick. I'm curious now. Well, Red, read every book. Thumbs up, see a movie. Blue Ribbon, pl get first place in the Stardew Valley Fair competition. Unforgettable suit, soup, delight the governor. Good neighbors, help your forest. Neighbors grow their family. Interesting. Distant shore, reached in dry island. Danger in the deep, reach the bottom of the dangerous mines. Okay. Infinite power, obtain the most powerful weapon. Perfection, reach the summit. I like the perfection achievement. What does moss do? I, as far as I'm aware, it's mostly bait stuff. Uh, I'm... Waiting for, uh, I didn't want to fish with the bamboo pole because I'm lazy, so I'm waiting for the fiberglass pole to buy from Willy. You can make moss. You can make moss log to grow mushrooms. He actually needs training rods because he's that bad. How do you get the mastery XP? Just by getting XP normally. Go get keys to the town, Mr. Streamer. Moss is a part of the ridiculous expensive items you hinted earlier. Yeah. Moss. Really fishy animation broke? I don't think it's broken. I think that's supposed to be a reflection in the water. What is this? Oh. The smoker. Anchovy bait. I think it's just the bobber. Yeah, now I have a blue bobber. Uh, 
I don't know. I would assume just by fishing. All right, so I need tilapia, red snapper, sardine. It's literally just a CC fishing day. I'm kind of fine catching extra fish because I'm going to need to do it eventually. And it's kind of free fishing XP right now. Wow, that chest, I mean, I get an XP bonus for it, but all that for for a geode. A geode. I wonder if there's a way to get tuna bait before tuna. Yeah, I heard. Well, I mean, I'm going to need the fishing pond, so I guess I should probably keep the seaweed. I don't need Maki Roll, but I need the fishing pond. I got nerfed. Yeah, Blade specifically got nerfed with that one. At the same time, he buys buying 999. Yep. I know I don't know if I'm a fan of it doing the do 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 every time that you get a uh, like a quality fish. I feel like that's just too common. Or is it like when you get the new record? Actually, I didn't hear it for the last ones. Something to sleep on. I could have had a perfect catch with a chest. It would have been such good XP, even if it's on a small mouth. Oh, it's like a first... Oh, okay, it tells you when you catch it for the first time. Oh, that's what that is. I really wasn't looking at the screen. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll catch the bream normally, because I'm going to have to do it eventually anyways. I'm going to ha I'm gonna catch two eels here as well. But I don't have to do it later with all the fish. Messing up these perfect catches, which kind of blows. Uh, don't need, don't need, don't need. I don't think I need that. Yeah, yeah. Any catfish and tiger trout now? I'm, yeah, I'm trying to catch all of these for fishing XP, by the way. Because I'm already here. 
I want to get level 10 in every skill to unlock that room in the south area. So I may as well do a little bit of fishing. I gotta catch every fish anyway, so I'll help with the having to do less crab pots. I don't know. I gotta complete the community center, so I don't really mind. What makes the Iridium Scythe better? It's Scythe Harvest mod. It's bonkers. It's a broken. What's the world record for this? Game came out three and a half hours ago. What's world record? Uh, yes and no. On legacy RNG, it works. On default RNG, no. I did, V. This run is an over 20 hour long run. Let me just finish it in three hours. Honestly, this run is probably going to take me about 30 hours with the pace that I'm going at right now. <laughs> I should be on Ginger Island in about like an hour. If I was on a good pace. I guess that's also if I was doing JoJo, but I'm not doing JoJo, so... Is the green bob or river jelly? I don't think CA will ever add the tractor mod in the game. It's not his style. It's the way. It's the reason why ho or hoppers are so bad. Because he wanted people to at least interact with the game, not just fucking AFK it like Minecraft. River jelly equals drowned slimes. I'm definitely going to need to take a break here and actually eat some food real quick, though. Okay, I need eels now. I am hungry. Eat mayo. I'm good. Eel. Surely CA didn't change any of the fishing patterns that I'm so used to. Already in fall. I've skipped a lot of days. <laughs> Unsurprisingly. I wonder if chains are better. I technically need a third eel for cooking, don't I? So I should probably catch three. I need one for turn in, two for cooking. Or 
Cranes can drop hardwood now. That's pretty good. Also, the EO quest, I don't think it's right now. I thought that was on the second. Kind of sucks for aesthetic designers not being able to plant trees in town, I would agree. Where are my eels at? What is the meaning of life? Thank you for enjoying my content. I missed a ring, didn't I? Oh, no. Uh, I don't think this is an eel. Albacore. It did not go high enough. Uh, I don't know how Game Pass works if you're playing on PC. For playing on console, it's probably not for another, like, week or two, minimum. Realistically, probably longer. I'm gonna turn stuff in and then catch the bream. I have no idea if the key, key arena has been implemented or not. Uh, it is very big, buddy. That's what she said, but it is very big. Hey, how my crab pot bundle is, uh... Not in the normal spot that I'm used to. Alright, uh, for Breams, the highest chance of getting it is in Water Up Zero, so I'm just gonna min cast here. Breams, go up to the second bar right here and just sit here like this is a Bream. I need a second one for cooking. Uh, this is a salmon for XP at this point, though. Yeah, I am live on the tubes. I'm gonna take a food break after this for like 30 minutes. I need some food. I wonder what the odds of getting the jellies are. I wonder if you get any of the books from the fishing chests. I mean... Probably, but I need to catch another salmon. I thought I had another one. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, it doesn't seem like they're too, too rare. They're not common, but... That would have been really hard to keep the chest and the fish in together. I 
Come on, one more Bream, please. I made my bobber into a burger. There's a burger bobber? That's hilarious. I wonder if you unlock them through, like, achievements. I'm surprised I haven't gotten a second bream. The game gave me one bream right off the bat and has just refused to give me another one. I need to run home soon because apparently you lose a lot more money if you pass out. <laughs> Uh, I mean, yes and no. I think some books are really bad just fundamentally with how fast you can level things up, but other books are good. How much money you lose? Apparently you can lose up to 15k. I don't know what the, I don't know how it's calculated. That's from dying. Yeah, but pass it. Uh, yeah. I mean, we'll see. Somebody said you lose a, a crap ton to me, so. I will be on the worry side until then. Oh, I'm gonna sell these fish. I do not need them. Dog in the way. Oh, new warm bin. Deluxe bait. Oh, wow. You can actually just craft deluxe bait now. All right. Then what, what crafting recipe does Linus give? That's the crafting recipe. Moss and five bait. Oh, that's actually... Us. Increase the size of the fishing bar. Oh, the, okay. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Huh. Oh, we're gonna need a lot more moss, but that's pretty good. Alright, uh... I'm gonna sleep one more day. All right, I'm gonna pause the timer. I'm gonna give you guys bone zone, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna give you guys bone zone. I'm then going to uh, turn on my soundtrack or my playlist and uh, go eat for like 30 minutes and just take a break, get up, stretch. I recommend doing the same. Get up, stretch, get around, move your body. Don't sit here for three hours, three plus hours. You know, maybe get up and dance to the song. Uh, yeah, I need to get food. I will. Uh, I I will be coming back and continuing streaming. I'm not ending stream like I normally would here. But, yeah, I need a break. It's good to. Uh, I'll probably also read the public patch notes. <laughs> Just to see anything that I've missed. Spotify, please work. I will be back. Here we go. 